At least three. But you can uh, you can roll uh, up to four. So I, I, I got four. Wow. This this is a little strange, but welcome to Gel- Fellowship Gaming. Here to uh, entertain you with yet another tale of daring disaster and dimwits. So please grab your favorite drink and perhaps a snack and let us regale you with songs of our misdeeds. Tonight we will be playing Torg Eternity, which is a D20 multiverse system. Card supported. I don't know. worry about it right now. If you would like to see more content, please check us out over on YouTube at fellowshipgaming.quest, where you can subscribe and hit that bell notification. So, what happened last time? Well, we're going to do some announcements real quick while you get that. As you all can see, we're in our new venue. We're in Jeremiah's Garage 2.0. The walls are fully insulated. The ceiling is fully insulated. Uh, the only thing that's not insulated is the garage door. So we may pay for money for that. Um, we are now back to our normal schedule of doing tabletop games on our, uh, Friday, Sunday schedules. Please go ahead and take a look and see what we have offered because we definitely want you to come out and have a good time. Back to Casey. So, yes, they had uh, last episode, they ran into a techno demon by the name of Dr. Belfagor, the desecrator and torturer of souls, who was putting them on the track to another one of Marion's clones. Okay. Before and they get... ran into a site. My just God. seemed hungry. Yeah. My Cosm card says I have to play when draw. <laughs> okay. What is it? Fakolu? Fakolu? Attack. Oh, F me. <laughs> when a mishap is rolled, while you or an ally cast a spell in Falkold, a techno demon attacks. Oh, Jesus. All, all storm knights gain one to three possibilities after the battle. Depending on the strength of the techno demon, if there are no spellcasters in the group, looks like there is a spellcaster. There so. is a spellcaster. Yep. Okay, so then discard the card and draw again. But since we have a techno, you do have a spellcaster. So it's only on mishaps when he's casting a spell. Correct. There you go. So I don't. Go ahead with the recap. So, so that was my big thing. Okay. Um, yeah. No, you are basically kind of the battle is over. Um did the dragon run away or I think We dragon, booked it. You yeah. booked it. We we hid we Oh are, that's right. Yeah, we, we hid did. as we were running and it was just feasting upon Luna. Yep. That was a mouthful. <laughs> How many wounds till you die? Uh, three, unless you have yeah. a okay. perk. It's number of wounds. When you hit that, you die. Shock is shock plus one. I have two wounds. Well, okay. it's not you die. It's you roll for defeat. You test for yeah. defeat. Yeah. Not for the hands, but defeat. <laughs> yes. You test for defeat. And if you make it, you suffer a nasty, Get a wound. visible wound, visible scarring, based on what? But Six. if you, but if you get it, uh, well, it's also gradated. Gradated? That's not a word. Degraded. It's graded. If you just do a normal success on your, you get a nasty wound. If you get a good, you get uh, still get a wound, but it's less nasty. If you get an outstanding. There's no outward panel, uh, outward yeah, visibility. Like, I was taking a look at Kim. I'm like, I was like, how is Kim gonna? Get, he's gonna have. He's gonna be baby faced, Kim, the entire time. It's mental scarring. Yeah, yeah. He's got some. He's he's got some uh, he's smooth like, brain going. He's like, on. I'm already. Yeah, I'm already there. 
Um, what's today's date? I think that's six the first one. character today I've ever... Today is the seventh. Six, seven. So six, so badly mentally scarred that he was taken out of it. He, he's got some issues. Yeah. He, he, was, he, yeah. he saw one of his good friends immolate in front of him. I'm, I'm sorry. That's a... He comes back, Xavier's there. He's like, what the? I just yeah. dealt with this trauma. Like, Yeah, no, he's going to have serious he's like, issues. Everybody else sees him too, right? <laughs> <laughs> and, I'm like, and everyone's like, yeah, see who? he's been... No, no, up. it'd be funny if you're like, see who? <laughs> oh, are you the tallest member of the fellowship? He's got me by a little bit. Do okay. I? Not okay. much. I, I'm just commenting on the framing. Yeah. It's yeah. either that or Casey's like, I like to be really up close. <laughs> no, it's, no, it's nothing fine, has been fine. fully set up. I tested it for my height. But you lean back. I, I do lean back a little. Yeah, you lean back. I tend to be more in the face. And Fred likes to be as far no, away no, from No, 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 no. Like, if you pay attention, possible. if you pay real close attention, it's like every <laughs> anime when the character's about to go insane, just right up and they like all you see is like the square yeah. in the eyes and he's like i learned something today <laughs> i i noticed this I, so my wife made a comment about it because when i gm i i do this because i do it at <laughs> home too yeah she's like why are you slouching like that and i'm like what do you mean it's like i, I think i'm engaging because i am but i'm also like low to the yeah. table like what's going on because i'm always writing stuff like hey I'm guys like, how's it going over there yeah, yeah. <laughs> and when i gm i'm like yeah Full on military. Yep. <laughs> You're just straight back. It's cool. Ah, it's time to do it. Because the thing is, I don't want to give things away, so I'm trying right. to keep. You, you're trying to get your face. poker face going. Exactly. Yeah, I know. I feel military you. Military discipline. It's like, I cannot laugh at this. I want to laugh at this. Do not. Don't you dare laugh at this. <coughs> See, I have that difficulty. I'm like, oh, this is gonna be great. You're all gonna die. All right. <coughs> yeah, and I, it's, I, it's I funny, just like I wrote Doctor Professor Belfagor. <laughs> I mean, the doctor I know, is in I know. air quotes. Yeah. Literally, he is. He doesn't mm. have a doctorate in anything. He's okay. a techno demon. Yeah. Shit, does he attack us? <laughs> no, no, oh, no. We, 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 we made well, a no, deal know, with him. No, he, he is a passive yeah. attack. Yeah. Demon attack. He might if, if he rolls a uh, if he rolls a miss. Oh no! <laughs> oh no! Okay. Yeah. We gotta come so, with, yeah, Dr. Belfagor and L, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yes, it was L. What's come back? Why it's last name? Oh, no, you find them. No. Zed. Zed. No, that's not Zed. No, that's Wade. Wade. Wade, Wade. <laughs> Wade, Wade, Wade. Zed's not here. Right? Zed is not here. No, it reminds me of the end of Gantz where you're L just looking is, at the people I'm, I'm of dead. I'm trying to remember Wade's surname because he did have a surname in the episode. I think we asked about it. Do we know Wade's last name? I don't think so. Oh, I thought I could have sworn we, we can take a look at the character. It doesn't matter. Well, I don't have anything other than his character sheet. So it's Wade Watts. Know. It's not Wade Watts. <laughs> I no. thought that too. And let's then not, I was like, let's not use that isn't. Watts last name in Utah. <laughs> no, oh, Wade Watts. Deadpool? I, I know. Is Watts I've been a, watching true crime. Is Watts a bad name? Chris is it, Watts. I don't know who that is. Murdered his whole family. Well, oh, his wife. Not, well, he did murder his whole family. but That's bad. Yeah, 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 Billy. It's real bad. <laughs> we need to get on track. Yeah. We're on track. We're you anyway. <laughs> We're waiting for the techno demon yeah. to attack. Huh? We're all relaxed, like yeah, you guys Oh, are we all just like, got out of yeah. No. You guys are all keyed up. <laughs> just not happy. No, but you do find L oh, and Dr. Belfagor. Slightly moved that. There we go. We're I, I we're still in panic mode. We're just trying to get out. I, I know. You're right. Where running. are we going? Guys, let's Doctor, where we need to go? I don't remember. <laughs> I well, whatever, but not yeah, here. You know what? Everyone, give me a spirit test. Spirit, spirit, All right. or willpower if you have it. It's spirit. <sighs> right. Okay, I'm at a thirteen. I legit forgot how to play the game for a second. I was like, I got a 15 on the die. That means nothing. <laughs> I got a 7. I mean, it means a minus 4. I mean, no, it doesn't. 15 is a positive. Oh, Not a high positive. 15 is a 2. That's one more. Well, two more than I got. I rolled 13, so. Okay. I rolled an 11, got a 7. Okay, he 
he has willpower. Oh, he has yeah. willpower out the butt. You okay. have a, got a total of seven. Correct. Yeah, he's got a six charisma and no willpower. My spirit is seven. Spirit. It's not oh. charisma. <laughs> my spirit oh, that's, is, I didn't even charisma. Yeah, my then. spirit is yeah. seven. Yeah. Okay. I didn't get, I got no okay, bonus. Okay, he got no bonus. So, I mean, Wade. Oh, yeah, I have two wounds, so I'm actually below that. Yes, you are. Oof. I'm going to say you take two shock just from the adrenaline suddenly dropping and you kind of oh, that's stumbling and falling. Shock you know, was I think blue. You guys my shock. Yeah. I hate that when your adrenaline just stops and you're just like, huh, that's yeah. all. <laughs> yeah, I so suddenly have blood like, coming at me. I'm going to sleep now. Alan yeah. got an 18 total. I'm so okay. Uh, 13 total. 13 total. Okay. Usagi got a 10. Okay. Do you want me to write a shot? Oh, yeah. For I, for I rolled no. not well, but yes. I was like, oh, I, I'm the spirit okay. character. so. Because this has been a stressful thing. Everyone needs to roll willpower. Yeah. Or spirit. She got a 12. Okay. So... Wade, his body just realizes that he's no longer in danger, cuts off the adrenaline, and he suddenly stumbles and just falls flat on his face. Wait, you went over your shock limit? I no. don't... That's what gave him the two shock. No, I just want to make sure, like, so he's not unconscious, he just is... He shouldn't be, but yeah. what is your total shock right now? Right now, I don't have anything right now. Okay. okay, then you just took two shock damage. Okay. Yeah. yeah. And it is basically your adrenaline shut off and your muscles are like, okay, we're done. And you just couldn't stay standing. Well, I'm also pretty hurt, so I'm not surprised. Yeah. So, yeah, you hear, everyone hears, everyone kind of stop, gets out of panic mode, gets a breath, and Wade just falls flat. Hey, um, uh, Alan, we'll turn to Wade looks so really Xavier. beat up Xavier and says, is there anything you can do for our friend over there? <sighs> Unfortunately, not anymore. Uh, when I became deceased, my, uh, miracles stopped working. Mm. It's, uh, m more mental than spiritual. Um, I could. Nope. <laughs> never first mind. First aid is a thing. Yeah, yeah. but I, you have to interact with the person to do first aid. Yeah, and he I'm can't a do ghost. Good first aid. Woo! Yeah, that's true. He is. Um, because we, I, we definitely meant to, but we didn't talk about me taking shock to interact with the mortal world. Um. Okay. So, um. Alan has nothing to assist with. And Usagi is just like, he falls, she stops, and she's just stone-faced. Okay, well, <sighs> good news. First aid is not actually uh, dependent on skill skills. You, you can, can try you can it. You can use untrained? untrained? Which is a mind, right? It's a mind. I cannot see the yeah. Yeah, I, bold. It is not in bold, so it okay. is 100% untrained. If you want to do it, or she doesn't have first aid. Yeah, if you trust Doctor Belfagor to try it. Yeah, I mean, sure. I mean, we're out of options. Yeah, <laughs> he's like, ah, oh, yes, I have had much experience. Um. Wonderful. Not treating the wounded. Making the wounded. But learning about wounds and their effects on the human body or the I'm race. I'm not quite but sure about this. Shh, shh. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> hey, wait. Believe me, there work? are worse things that could be happening. Yeah, you could be dead. Listen, Casey can throw other templates at you. Just <laughs> relax. <laughs> Fred's like, what's Remind a ghoul template? Your... It's great for Wade. Let's go. <laughs> oh, wow. That's a nice roll. Take it. Yeah, I'd take it too. Second one was not as impressive, but the first one more than made up for it. So um, that is a total of 
23, which is an outstanding success. So you heal one wound, and I will say you no longer suffer wound penalties from his ability, his stitching you back up. It hurts like hell because he doesn't bother with anesthetic. He doesn't have one. All your shock is healed too. But yeah, your shock is healed, and he does get one wound. That was cool. I, I was looking that up. Typically, that says stuff about wounds and shock, but if, in theory, if you get an outstanding or good success during a first well, usually or treatment, within a couple of minutes, the shock goes away, anyways. Yeah, it's like ten minutes per shock or something like it's that. It's when I decide to tell you it goes away. That's true. <laughs> that's also <laughs> that's true. that's the one rule about shock. Yeah. It, it only matters when it's wrong. goes away. When the GM says the shock goes away. Okay, so and it gives me guidelines on that. Something's which is, happening with that, and it's warping. Yes. Wow. Yeah. I don't know if it's just hot or. I don't know. Let's see, nope, that didn't help. It's behind you. Okay, that's a hell of a lot better. For a moment. <laughs> For the moment. Work with us. Sorry, Work. people. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> Very Look, good. We, we're, like, we're just getting back into this. So yeah. technical difficulties, readjusting things. <laughs> All right. Um, why did my brain just shut down? Okay. You're healed and on the mend. I healed You're on one. the mend, on I the should mend. say. Yeah. Like I so said, you have one wound still. You still no have penalties. a wound, but you no longer take the penalties from it. He did mm. a good job. Yeah. Mm. He did an impressively good job. You were like, wow, I really didn't think you could use a piece of shirt thread like wow. that. I can see the bone still. <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> you know. <laughs> but it's no longer bleeding, so. Yeah, he's not bleeding. But, I mean, right now you're still fatigued. Yeah. Al comes back like, hey, chick stick scars. <laughs> Alan has an attractive scar on his left shoulder. Yeah. That's what interested. his notes say. <laughs> Al is not interested. That's what he took his wound. So, Xavier has skunk hair. Oh, yeah? <laughs> yeah. Remember, he got fright. Yeah. yeah, yeah, right. yeah. I think that's cool. Yeah. <laughs> You guys are going to shoot me if I try to get you back in Oris. I don't know. Thorkold has been deadly. Aurors was just... Terrifying. And long. It's hard to get out of Aurors. There's by a train. reason for that. Especially by train. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Or boat. Or, yeah, I mean, no, no, no. Yeah, no. Aurors no. is very much... Once you're there, yeah. it doesn't want you to leave. Yeah, it's very much the horror trope of. Oh yeah, every check time in, you turn you check around, in, yeah, you can't. The bad guy. Yeah. Once yeah, you like... check in, it's really hard to check out. Hotel, yeah. Hotel California. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, that that is a role Sierra game. Madre, man. I will absolutely use that whenever you are in Aurora. I will make your lives as difficult as I can. Love Never it. going back. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What's I that? have so much cool stuff in Aurora. Like, oh, Aurora? And yeah, any no, place that light touches. What's that place over there? That's Aurora. Don't ever go there. <laughs> <laughs> we do not go there. <laughs> Are you going to go pee on the dark place? <laughs> Such All right. a good meme. Um, okay. So we find the professor. We find L. Yeah. We're recouping. You're recouping. And... I wish I had my notes. I'm annoyed that I don't have the next. Because you said that uh, he was directing us towards clones. Yeah. We're going to the next location. And unfortunately, I, I don't remember any of the conversation. Yeah, it's been two months. It's okay. Yeah. Well, I, I, I watched like 40% of the episode, and I kind of jumped a little bit just to kind of get a blurb. And it was two combats. Oh, it wasn't really two combats. It was a, uh, a nice communique with. Belphegor, and then the combat. And yeah. then the combat that yeah. took forever. Mm -hmm. It really did. Because it, it was both a combat and... An yeah. encounter. A, 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 it, a, a, a dramatic. Dramatic. Thank you. I was like, I could think of a word. Yeah. Because those things are scary. Yeah. 
They're meant to be scary. So that was fun. Okay. All right. Do I have um, Yeah. All right. Let no. me see if, I, if there's anything I can do prior with precog before. All right. So knowing a little meta that Fred played a Cosm card that eventually, very, very soon, we're going to get beat up potentially. I'm going to play Foreshadow, so I'm going to roll Precog. It's very hard, and if I succeed, I get to look at the drama deck. Okay, so 14 is a... Jeez, that's just a plus one. Okay, so that well, puts me at 19. While he's doing that, I'm discarding Nemesis for a possibility what? and a new card. I'm going to play Willpower to add three <laughs> to that. <laughs> Continue. And that gives me a good, which means I can look at the top three cards of the drama deck and rearrange them at my leisure. Okay. Great. All right. Uh, now I've got to remember the rules. <laughs> you can't discard this time. Nope. I cannot. Remind me, combats are under standard or dramatic? Standard. 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 Thank you. Oh, these are all good. Tell you what, it is nice to be back playing Torg. I'm gonna do. <laughs> I think I like those. I really needed a break. Because I Valid. really didn't have a storyline where I was going. Perfectly understandable. And now I have a storyline. I'd hope after two months. <laughs> Well, when it clicked, it clicked. I'm like, it does. That's it. Yeah. What is the? You've have you heard the, the Dungeons and Dragons rap? He goes, I won't have a storyline for you at least for at least three episodes. Haven't heard it. Oh, it's so good, man. Shorts. Sure. The fat guy where they do the D and D episodes. I know man yeah. shorts. Yeah. You said man shorts. I'm like, okay. Yeah, yeah it's fantastic. And then he wrote one right after the COVID restrictions lifted. Oh. It's so good. I uh, on D and I I uh, just started rewatching Exandria Unlimited. Oh yeah, such a in, it's, it's intriguing. Just so good. Like you can watch no critical role. Watch Exandria Unlimited. It's like four or six episodes, and it's Brendan Lee Mulligan basically running critical role through the precursor, like the pre-event to everything that happens in Exandria. Oh. So. What leads up to the cataclysm that messes um, up everything? Oh, yeah. spoiler! Asmodeus pulls the skin and the head, uh, the the like Earl from. Oh yeah, he pulls. Yeah, yeah. The skin he's like, suit. you were right, because he's a. Oh my god! Oh, oh. anyways, <laughs> um, Earl. <laughs> what? Okay. Was it Earl? Um, uh, from no, no, no. Uh, Men in Black. From Men in Men Black, Black, I know. Yeah. I suit. immediately knew he what he was when we were like. He pulls his, and he's like, now yeah. turning around in a new Edgar suit. Edgar. Yeah. Edgar. Edgar. That's what it was. Thank you. D'Onofrio did a fantastic job. Like, Dumbly. I forget he's there. Dude, it's, I forget he's Edgar. Um, every, yeah. Well, he doesn't look like him. He's No. He's still he heavy, wears but leg he's braces. way lighter, and then he has hair. Yeah, well, he wears leg braces yeah, yeah, to yeah. do the whole to, waddle. To shimmy because of the, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Like, brilliant actor. I love him as Kingpin. He was amazing as Kingpin. Oh, I can't believe we're going to get him again. Oh, oh yeah. They're doing a new Daredevil series yeah. and I was like, let's go. <laughs> I heard they had to rewrite that. Yeah. Yeah, but could, well, cuz Echo was stupid. <laughs> no no offense. Uh, Echo Echo had too much. <sighs> no, no, they she just, was native they, and deaf. I don't mind all these any of that crap, like whatever, but he's the kingpin. Yeah. There's no way Echo beats him ever. Yeah. Sorry. Daredevil barely matches him. Spider-Man had to fuck you had to go unhinged <laughs> to whoop his ass. Electra does not well, do well against Electra, him. Electra is like Daredevil on crack. Yeah. And they don't do her in the movie with Ben Affleck. They don't do her the same service. Because she's no. literally the Batman of the Marvel yeah. universe. Well, like even the comics, she goes up against him once or twice. And it's, she's just... Oh, yeah. No, he bodies her yeah. the second time. Yeah. He just... Bah! Done. <laughs> l- 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 no, he literally grabs her face and just... And, yeah, nope. Yeah. And you're um, like, there, oh my gosh. So there's a moment where the Hulk is fighting She-Hulk in <laughs> World War Hulk, and he does that to her. And they're like, oh, the She-Hulk. No, she doesn't get stronger. 
She's just, she is strong at a base level compared to the Hulk at a base level. An unbothered, unmitigated, unriled Hulk is on par with She-Hulk. She doesn't get matter. She doesn't get she doesn't stronger. Scale. She doesn't scale. He does. He scales to the point where he could crack the earth with a stomp and was doing it. No, he just bodies her. Bum! Stop. When, when he's, I mean, granted it's a scroll, but when he shrugs off Black Bolt screams, like, I didn't hear you, I didn't come here to hear you whisper. I came here to hear you scream. And I'm like, oh no. <laughs> even, a, even a scroll Black Bolt is still a bad dude and the whole bodies him. So anyways, What yeah. is that, the good guy, the, the other guys? You have the right to remain silent, but I want to hear you scream! <laughs> <laughs> anyways, anyways, I foreshadowed. Yeah, okay. Uh, we're regrouping. Everybody okay? Wait, wait. You all you're right, my guy? All right. All right, Cher. Let's go. Yeah. Belfigur's like, yeah, I don't actually know where we're at anymore. Oh, yeah. yeah. I don't either. <laughs> We need to go back to the surface and retrace our steps back to where I was. Oh, where are we? Are we in a... We're not in a subway. Yeah. Are we in a subway? Okay. I was like, am I crazy yes. thinking we were in yeah. a subway? Yeah. Well, you're in an underground. We're... Yeah. We're under the ground because that was really the only way to get away from the Correct. dragon. I, I couldn't... That, that, I remember we were underground, but I don't... I think I'm conflating... Because I think it wasn't the subway how we got to Isle. Or we were doing something with Isle in the subway? Yes, we did something in Isle okay, with Subway. Okay. My, my, just yeah, my brain. Yeah, yeah. yeah, no, you're good. I'm making sure it's we're on yeah, the correct. Yeah, that was a long, long time ago. Yeah. Could be Tuesday for Kim me. Kim was absolutely saying, we need to turn around and go the other yeah, way. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you're still going down. Yeah. And then we met the elves, <laughs> and then you built the drill. Yeah. 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 <laughs> After you got some. <laughs> That's right. That's right. <laughs> hey, yeah, and I still wasn't there for that one. No, you weren't. Yes, you, what? No, I was not. No, there. he was not. I was in. His there. character was being botted. Someone else played the romance. Oh right. Yeah, I was not there. I think Brian. Fred was not character. there. Yeah, yeah. Brian. Because Zed is so anti-romance, it's not funny. Yeah. Well, Fred's like, I've had seven wives. I'm done. <laughs> I don't need a fictional one. <laughs> right. <laughs> I've already been married twice. I don't need to do it. Fred, if I play the romance card on you. (laughs) Run away! Ooh, that's a valid question. I think it says NPC, but that's a valid question. Would you both get get the possibilities? No. Okay. Because it does say NPC. Okay, it does. Okay, that's that's fine. I was curious. Wow, way to call Fred an NPC. Yep. (laughs) That hurts. All right. Yeah, I'll remember that on top side. Traveler. (laughs) <laughs> I'll remember it's okay, that you get boned in Traveler anyways. Um, uh, anyway. So, yeah, Mulfagor is like, yeah, we need to at least get our bearings on the surface and try and get back to my hideout for a minute. All right. Um, who, so who all do we have with? We don't have Miriam anymore. No. no. We don't have... We have just L as far as clones yeah. and NPCs. And then we have the four of us. Alan, mm-hmm. Xavier, Wade, and... Alan. I already said Alan. Um, oh. I'm trying to remember her name. Oh, I'm getting... It starts with a K, but I, it's like Sakura? No, it's not Sakura. No. That's the... Kimiko? Why, why am I thinking... <laughs> What's her name? Usagi. Oh, never mind. Who's a you? It's Bunny. Funny. Sorry, sorry. I was. No, it's okay. Kimi- it's isn't okay. Kimiko the name of the girlfriend? Oh, it's Yumiko is the name of the girlfriend in Negasonic Teenage Warhead or whatever. Yeah, yeah, is. yeah. The uh, Pinkie Pie. Yeah, yeah. I, I, I'm gonna go watch the movie because I was like, I'm gonna buy a shirt. <laughs> <laughs> it's good. It says What's it believe, say? in, believe yourself. in yourself. Maximum effort. <laughs> <laughs> My next character is gonna be Deadpool. Try me. <laughs> I don't think there's a regeneration in the game that matches that. No, no, but I'm going to play around with Miracles and uh, uh, Fourth Wall Breaks. Okay. That's basically what all precog is. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah no, 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 no. Pretty no. much. Like, oh, because I, I have uh, uh, Simplify the Environ. Okay. Uh, I can use possibility to cancel situation line during a dramatic scene. So yeah, I, I didn't know I had go that. Back to I could have used that during your the last precog. Episode. Yeah, a b- 
ability and do what I was planning to do yep. before I got completely sidetracked. Yeah. And so what you see is your group is in Bulfagor's hideout. Yeah. And he has a device open. It looks like probably a laptop. And it's got what looks like a program that's a map with a ping on it. Oh, okay. Like a pin or like a like a pin? Yeah, like a pin. Okay, like okay. Like a loca- like like location. There's a yeah. pin in this location. And that's what I see? That's what you see, but you don't see enough to see the location itself. Correct. Um, but I can tell him, like, yeah, I think that's a great idea. I actually got a visual clarity of uh, a map with a pin. On your computer? On a computer? Well, yeah, I have a computer. Yeah. What? Oh, oh. Um, sometimes I get flashes of, of future events, potential future events. I'm not saying we can change the future. We, we haven't yet, but we could. We could alter <laughs> waves of reality. And I mean, it's. It, well, you know about the realities, right? Dude, you're making I my head hurt. reality. Welcome to the day. He's smarter now. He's like, I don't have a physical body, so he's like, let's be smart. <laughs> smart. No, that's terrible. <laughs> Not Jake Peralta. Toy. Toy. Toy, like a toy. Sorry. <laughs> okay, so. All right, you guys are, you know what? Give me stealth checks. Excellent. Yeah, because we're definitely still I on Because I think the, everyone is still is on stealth edge. an option? Yeah. Yeah, it's uh, dexterity based. Dex based. Um... Usagi's fairly unresponsive at this point. She's catatonic. Yeah. Hey, it's it's not the end of the world. You, it, it'll come back, right? I mean, isn't it made of sparkles and magic? Oh, she brought me my gems. Oh. Um. Yeah, hey, so... I'm going to spend a possibility because I rolled a three. Good night. That's three 18s in a row. You rolled a three. Um, that is a 15 stealth for Alan. Is it a minimum of 10? Yes. I'm also at a 15 stealth. Ha <laughs> uh, ha ha. 10s don't explode if you don't have skills, right? Tens always explode. Twenties yeah. don't. Twenties only okay. if you have points. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Can we do it three times in a row? Nope. Uh, twenty-seven <gasps> plus nine. Uh, Usagi has a nineteen. Nice. She didn't even do anything for that, too. Yeah, that's nineteen. 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 Do you roll for Alan? Uh, yeah, Alan has a 15. 15, that's right. Swipe to So Alan got a 16, and I got a 17 stealth. Okay. 15. So I, I think okay. Alan and I at 15 are the lowest, yeah. other than whatever Professor Balfour. Balfour. No, he he's did pretty well. Nice. Okay. So, yeah, you guys are actually able to sneak, and yeah, you do see the shadow pass over a time or two. She does kind of freeze a little bit. Yeah. Not like, oh, I'm freezing in this place, but more just like terror. Mm-hmm. What's a, I was like, what's the role for psychological? What's the role for psychological damage? I don't know. <laughs> Ask is, Casey. No, no, there. <laughs> Willpower would be the role. Okay. And depending on how psychologically damaged you think you are, I will set a DC for that. <laughs> that that's That's how it would work. Yeah. Yeah, I can't even like put or a hand you on can her just shoulder. Admit that your character is psychologically damaged. Shaken's not a thing here, right? It's mm. just stymied. Stymied, stymied or vulnerable. Or vulnerable. Yeah. She's most likely yeah stymied because it's for self. Yeah, vulnerable. Yeah. You can be both, but yeah. Yeah, she can be both, but. In this situation, I would probably say vulnerable. Yeah. She's not reacting the way she should be. A 
I'm already dead. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Alan's just kind of like, we'll, we'll take care of it. Yeah. Don't worry. Luna should come back. That's sure. how the Nile works. Yeah. I came back. Yeah. Like, he's legitimately trying to calm her down. Oh, yeah, no, and, like, yeah. yeah, he's like, They're from the same cosm, yep. so, like, yep. he understands a lot better than she does. It's like, Nile, yeah. nothing, nothing yeah. that's dead stays nothing dead. Nothing is truly dead in the Nile. To be fair, he came over, her, so, like, yeah. he definitively knows. Yeah. He's like, oh, yeah, no, Luna will, Luna will probably come back. Okay. Every black cat. Is this Luna? No? Okay. Oh. What's going on? Never mind. Nothing. Okay. Something I looked at and thought was bad, and then I realized, oh, yeah, there's that. Okay. And so, yes. Okay. Things are being captured that should be. Good. Cool. To my knowledge. Well, we're streaming well enough. Yeah, it's like we have a hard line. <laughs> Moist. And my Toy. buddy and my buddy put that in over the weekend. He literally just like he's like, Where do you want it? He just stabbed this stabbed the screwdriver, cut it out, popped the box in, ran the line over, yeah, and well. we jury rigged because we tried to put it into our communications closet, but the people who did the electrical decided to like you know those cans of foam? Mm-hmm. Literally, they just popped the top off, chucked it in there, and said, have fun. That's what it looks like. <laughs> they literally just sprayed on top of everything. I'm like, that's not what you do. You don't do that. They spray foam to every low voltage line. It's garbage. Yeah. Uh, and so, like, we finally got down to, like, we were trying to run it down. Couldn't do it. So I, we, I was like, well, what if you just run it over to my front room line down and go from there? So we have two lines in my front room, and I literally... Internet comes in and it goes to my router and then I plug it right back in <laughs> for this line. It works. You know what? It works. Yeah. If it works, it works. Whoever gets the house after you is going to be confused as all hell. That's all labeled, so it's fine. <laughs> that does not look labeled. No, the, the labels are in there. They're still going to legitimately be confused as to why there is a hard line into the garage ceiling. I mean, <laughs> eh, it's okay. I don't plan on selling. The light switch I plan on dying. You don't plan on selling it. I plan on dying in here. I, I, I get it. <laughs> That's never Same the plan. Next week, we bought our <laughs> <laughs> we bought our house, and I was like, "Well, this is my this is where I'm dying." So <laughs> I've got enough insurance. Death insurance, death insurance, life, life insurance. insurance, life insurance. Life it insurance. should be called death insurance. We got enough death insurance to cover the house. <laughs> I, I would like death insurance. Uh, I, it only pays out as long as you're still alive. <laughs> That's called working. <laughs> Fuck. <Yeah>. Right. <laughs> Unfortunately. Okay. All right, but yeah, you do make it back to the hideout. Yeah. Let's not and do I that mean, again. Huh? Let's not do that again. I mean, that was, that was asking a, the weather not to weather. It, it's a shame that my friend Kim wasn't here. He'd have relished that. Oh, yeah, he would have. Def- he was like, Dragon! He'd have been like, yeah, no, I'm, I'm like, <laughs> he shows up. I'm like, Hulk, dude, you no. missed. I'm like, I, Meta, you missed a chance to get Dragon Slayer. Fuck! <laughs> like, no, Hulk, stop. Big monster! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I remember that. Dragon! <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Hmm. He's gonna read this report and just be like, "Screw you guys." <laughs> <laughs> okay, so yeah, you do make it back, and Belfagor kind of looks at you for a second, walks over to his computer, opens it up, and powers it on, and you can tell he's kind of. Boom. Got this bated breath, like he's he's weirded out because he's <laughs> like, I was gonna do this, but now, and sure enough, once everything loads in, he looks and there's a communique. He opens it, and all it is is a map with a pin in it, hmm. with a location. 
And now you can read the location. Arash. Nope. It is within Tharkold still. It is south of you. Well, actually west of you, I should say. Oh yeah, where are we again? Uh, we're you in are Russia. Somewhere Russia, yeah. in Russia. But we don't know. Well, we're we walked through a portal and we don't know. Yeah, we were in the living lands down underneath the pyramid with the thing. No, you're, no, you're right. The thing you're right, goes through. Right, we right. went through and we were like, oh, this I, is a good I, idea. I remember as Xavier, I made a comment like, oh, if I had my phone, I'd be able to check Google. Oh, no, I'm a ghost. Yeah, <laughs> I remember. But yeah, you see that ping. It, it looks like it's in Kharkov. Ukraine. Did you say Tarkov? Kharkov. Oh, Kharkov. Tarkov. Like, Kharkov. Kharkov. Krakokov. K H A R K I X. If I'm reading this right. It, no, V. It's a V. It ends with a V. <laughs> okay. I was like. <laughs> I was like, X. Okay. That's not Cyrillic, but whatever. <laughs> yeah, right? And El Fogor is like, okay, I'm not going there. We can, right? Sure. You're probably more welcome there than I am. Oh. Oh, do they have a problem with your type of peoples? Well, yeah, that, that, that's controlled by Volkov. How bad is he? It's Alan talking. What is he? He's a human. Oh. He really hates us. He's the one that nuked the bridge. Oh, damn. He's also one of the ones that is in the running for the darkness device. What's his name? I mean, you could just spell Karkov. Oh, oh, that's his name? Oh, I thought that's where... That's no, Volkov. I'm sorry. V-O-L-K-O-V. I was going to look for a first name. But Volkov works. Over in the corner, Usagi is muttering to herself that if you pay attention, you hear sometimes the greatest battles are fought within ourselves. Yeah. Uh, and, and, use and, all it's, and it's both through loss and gain that we find our true being. Shut up, this is an anime. <laughs> game, Fuck it, I'll Google that. Gain Axe is going bankrupt. With? Gain Axe? Evangelion, Fully Cooley, oh, Gordon I, Logon. I thought they had gone ages no. ago. No. I mean, what, that, other than Fully like, Fooly Cooley's still like 12 years old. Like, what's the le most recent thing they've done? I can't it? remember, but like, oh. I made a comment because like, fan service, the term fan service yeah. was, used to be called Gain Axing yeah. because Gain Axe came up with the concept. And I was like, huh. man, a company that comes up with fan service is lo losing. I mean, literally, how do you fail? I mean, yeah. That's rough. Well, I it's so I read something because my wife's huge into anime that um, there there's a meme. Well, she is. No, no, no. I'm not laughing at you. Okay, there's a meme. It's called "It Smells Like Twelve Episodes." So basically, <laughs> every you know what I mean. Yeah. Every, every animation gets basically a twelve episode. Like here's seventy grand. Go do it. Yeah, it's a pilot. Up, it's a pilot season. Basically, um, and that's how you know you know success or failure is determined by how many people watch it and, and uh, how much money it makes through merchandise and stuff like that. Um, but there was a... I don't know where I was going with that. So, Well, uh, it was enough time for him to read the, the rule he needed. Good. Yeah. It, it just gives me President Volkov. Okay. That's fine. There's no other... I wrote himself. Volkov, Darkness Device. I mean, Vladimir, Rikhail, Mikhail... Yeah, Mikhail. Yeah. Bratislav. Whatever. But one of, one of my favorite Volkov. fighters is Alexander Volkanovsky. <laughs> it's not him, but he's like five foot two. He's a bad dude. He's really cool. All right. How do we? Where? Where? Is there a second location from where we are to where that is? What do you mean a second location? 
You mean to know where you're at? Currently? Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Right. He kind of shrinks some of the map down a bit. You're probably. Let's see. Does this map have a scale? No. No, because why would they do that? I mean, we've been playing this for about we're, two years. We're There's 200 never miles scale. outside of Pripia. We need to get the hell out of Dodge. Yeah, you're probably about three or 400 miles away from there. That is so far. Yeah, well, not really. I mean, it is, but it's... By it's, foot, it is massive. By foot, yes. Yeah. By car, it's five hours. Yeah. I mean, to be fair, I'm, we're, we're still, like, in my brain, I'm still basing it off of Gunther and, and Okami going, let's do this shit! <laughs> Only halfway in across Dark Gold, it's two car races away. Yeah. <laughs> Sounds about right. I have two, that card. Sweet Tooth, what's the... Twisted, we're two twisted, metal. twisted metals away. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> yeah. I mean, you're not wrong. I'm not wrong. <laughs> oh, I now want to do a Twisted Metal, like, Battle Royale in Dark Gold. Yeah. Should bring you Thor over. Do it in Tharkhold way more than I do it in a Rorsch. Yeah. Do, yeah. Just, just a bunch of, like, nightmare. Like, the horses would fly. <laughs> bring Thorn over, man. Thorn would freaking love it. Yeah. <laughs> um, Hold on. I got to figure out how um, to so that. that. So he said that's his location, Volkov's location? Huh? He said that's Volkov's location? No. He doesn't know what that location oh, is. Oh, oh. Well, he said. So, oh, so what was to communicate? What's the context behind the map? There, no, nothing beyond that pin. I, I know. But so he, he just gets an email with a location. Right. So I'm asking him what email did he send out, and that's the response. Oh, he didn't. It was just random. Oh. He, he's like, I know it's from that woman. That woman. Okay. That you're hunting. Yep. We were back hunting a clone. You're hunting a clone. Yeah, we're always hunting clones at this point. Yeah. Sorry, I'm yeah. looking up a thing he can do. Nile He's like, yeah, that, that much I know. I did meet her and was able to get some information and told her if she needed help to contact me. Oh, okay. So. What the hell is this? That's the information I was looking for. Thank you. I was trying to figure out why we needed to go to that location. So now I know why. We, now I know understand why we need to go to that yeah. location. And out of yeah. curiosity, that woman, um, I give a description of the real woman, slightly older. Does, no, no. So Looks it's a lot more like that one. Okay, so young and nubile, and but with very decided dark hold implants. Yeah. Okay. Way goes, do you know anybody around here that has a car or a mode of transportation? It's entirely possible you could find one abandoned. Okay. Uh, it's entirely it's... possible you could find fuel to put in it, too. I like, oh, we're here? I think I know somebody like that. He plays Connection. Your hero knows someone in the area who can lend aid. Okay. Yeah, yeah. isn't Bob around here? <sighs> <laughs> what was the so so Wade? You're thinking back, and there was this Russian exchange student, baby, way back in school, probably about a year before this whole craziness happened. And he wasn't rich. His parents scraped to get him the money to do the transfer thing. Mm -hmm. But you do remember that they also owned a junkyard, and it was probably about. Oh, maybe 10 miles away from where you're at if you because you give this guy this address and you're like oh hey I've got this address you pull it up on your does he have a phone he has a phone he has a phone you pull it up on your phone this contact information and then he's like oh yeah I can put that in he puts that in and it's like 10 miles away but still What's it's that? a day's worth of travel if you're cautious well, mm -hmm. half a day if you're cautious, I should say. But it's close enough, and maybe he's there. And it's better than trying to go 500 miles. Agreed. And even if he isn't there, the junkyard. The junkyard I... is, yeah. Yep. I don't know how to fix a car. I can drive one, though. 
I mean, we could probably put our heads together and figure something out. Okay. I mean... Portal is only 50 meters. <laughs> <coughs> well, Dr. Belfagor says, I wish you luck. There's still plenty of daylight if you get headed out now. Okay. Thank you. Don't let the door hit your ass. Let on the me way see out. your phone for a second, though. Hand or a me. minute. Don't swipe left. <laughs> There's some pictures of you and Alan there. Oh, no. We're not even that. Oh, I heard <laughs> Alan. No, 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 whoa, whoa. <laughs> Holy. I heard I don't you know. and Alan, not you and Al. I was like, did Wade get Alan pregnant now? <laughs> Jesus. Well, it's, they're not even that, it's so oh. new. It's, they've only been going out for like two days now. Yeah. No, it's pretty new. Yeah. Yeah, he yeah, kind of like looks at your phone, like 11 times. flips it over a couple times, asks you to unlock it. <laughs> Wade's it locked. Oh, Wade locks it really good. Oh, okay. He, he doesn't want his mom to figure it out. Well, she definitely can't now. <laughs> <laughs> but you unlock it for him. Mm -hmm. He goes through a couple things, hands it back and says, it'll actually work on the net here now just makes me think of that scene from the core he goes takes the cum out and goes mm. you know how unlimited wi-fi oh yeah i do remember that yeah it's a good scene something something it, like that it's just a he does he fiddles with your phone for probably less than a minute and he oh. says okay your phone now has access to the grid here okay Agreed. must be nice so it will trace your location. So he can find out where we are? Yeah. You know where you're at. He, he, on his oh. computer, he, sh he zoomed out and showed us on the map approximately. Oh, I wanted to know if he can track the phone now. No, he didn't oh. do that. Wade's last name is Bridges. Like Jeff Bridges. Yeah. You, oh, you looked up the yeah. original character? Yeah, I looked okay. it up. Figured you wanted to know. But he's like, no, I didn't do that. Mainly because if I did that, they'd be able to track that. And I'm not helping them. That's okay. I got NordVPN. <laughs> <laughs> Your VPN won't work. You have, you have Demonware? <laughs> yeah, Demonware. <laughs> but I, I did install a Grid Drake hmm. to assist with that. Okay. Uh, all I can Xavier think of it is no, Xavier, he kind of yeah. looks at you and is like it's a sentient dragon program that is now guarding his phone cool that is if you go cool. into the grid and you run into it it looks Axon has all of the abilities that you would expect a dragon to have nice so if Kim kills that, does that count? <laughs> no. Oh, uh, well. Because it is still a program. I'm trying. Cool. Cool. Well, let's head, let's see if my buddy's there. Yeah, let's. Okay. Seven, ten miles? Yeah. So, yeah, and Belfogor is able to say, and if you follow this line, it's actually a sewer. But it goes perfect most of the way. Okay. You can enter it here, which is about a block over. Okay. Okay. And yeah, before we... anybody asks, we can't hurry or force march or anything crazy. Yeah, that's fine. Ghosts can't run. I know you can't. Thank you. <laughs> I don't feel like running. No, valid. I, I, I figured we would still also be super like... But I'm... I, I wasn't sure if I had stated it during the first episode you that have. Xavier was introduced. Yeah. I think I did, but it's been months, so. Yeah. Um, your my speed is 10. Your, your movement is 10, period. And that's <laughs> it. But I also don't make any sound when I move, and I don't fall. I just... <laughs> also, I'm stronger when it's darker, and I'm scarier when it's darker. You'd be like, Alan, turn off the light. 
Minus six. So I, I get a plus six to everything for certain aspects because it's the darkness penalty. Well, that's cool. Yeah. Is it your darkness penalty equals gives you boosts yep. or is it only at it's a negative no, six? Uh, so, no, it's uh, the, uh, the level of darkness gives me toughness and it boosts my taunt and intimidate. That's cool. And then the opposite is true. So the light level reduces my um, – Oh no, and then it's a negative for persuasion streetwise. So if it's dark, I'm scary. I fucking glow and shit. So yeah. they're like, I don't want to talk to you, scary dude. I'm like, valid. <laughs> and then the other, yeah. So there's some nice positives, but there's really crappy negatives. Like, oh, I can't run. Yeah. I'm the, I'm just. <laughs> <laughs> but I also can never be like slowed yeah. ever. <laughs> It's like the old joke in AD and D, dwarf movement, right? Six. Yes. <laughs> that sucks. No, no, no. You don't get it. Movement rate six. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Alan is doing his little flying thingy that he always does. Yeah. Yeah. Um. Okay. Uh, stealth checks, because I'm guessing you guys want to get to that place unseen preferably you know at least two enemies that are in the area that would like to eat you yeah Ooh, that's a lot that's not bad my dice are being convolutedly polite so to me tonight and that's kind of scary that's a 21 that's 16 and 16 okay 18 for Alan. Eighteen nope. Nineteen for Usagi. Okay. Can't count. That's okay. Counting's over. So, yeah, you guys are skirting over. And you do hear kind of close, but not terrifyingly close, the howl of those wolves. Mm. Oh, yeah. Which Belphegor helped us get out of that. And yeah. then you do find the sewer entrance he was mentioning. Good. And I assume you enter. Yes. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so you enter. It is dark. Um, I don't know how magic works. So it's all or nothing with his light spell. Yeah, but I don't know if it's flight. Oh, flight he just has. It's not a spell. Yeah, not, yeah. it's not a spell. That's a power he has. Okay, so. Yeah, so, yeah, his flight is a Nile thing. It's not yeah, a, it's a Nile. It's, yeah, it's a, it's, a, it's a pull yeah. power. Yeah, I was just trying to figure it out. So he needs to make a casty thingy. Uh, To his. Does anyone actually have Twitch open? I do. Yeah, I yeah. do. Okay. Why? What's up? Oh, just want to make sure we're not missing anyone talking. Yeah, no. No. Oh, I actually. That's not a bad idea. I should probably look at. We have Chat. no one talking to us. Yeah. I mean, we usually don't, but yeah. Not for Friday. Not we, for these we have Fridays. We're watching, but we have no talkers. Uh, yeah. I presume the three watchers are. Us. <laughs> Probably. My brother's watching. Cool. Nice. My wife's at drill. She can't watch. Sorry, I'm looking at the skill. Yeah, Conjuration no, I, 14. I have mine set up. I don't know if it's watching because I have been away for several hours yeah, and not. So been it'll able be a, to a base it. DC. It's difficulty eight. Yep. So. You, so uh, what is it? Abjuration. Conjuration. Okay, so yeah. it. Requires a conjuration roll with a DC of eight. Yeah, and so he's got 
20 and change. But I'm not seeing a if it's good or bad or better. No, it's just I, 10 yeah, feet. It's, it's 10 meters. That's all. Oh, no. Yeah. Okay. Here we go. Yeah. Sorry. I was just. And then I think on a, a outstanding, it can go up to 20. Dazzled victims are very stymy. That's all it says. So it's a radius of 10 meters. So it's 30 feet light. And it's yeah. bright, scintillating light. All darkness penalties within the light are negated, including the instances of mage dark. Um, any character or creatures who are in dark of pitch black conditions prior to casting are dazzled and automatically stymied. Yeah, but he can tell us to close our eyes yeah. first. Yeah. yeah. So, which is what he's done before. Yeah. And I, I know he's casting it, so I'm... Because that's what he did in the room when, when we, the, the darkness creature. He was like, light! And I was like, fudge! Okay, yeah. So I'm... So, I mean, 10 meters it's ahead. Maybe a little cramped. Because you're sewer. looking around. Yeah. It's an old sewer. Yeah. So, it's been around since at least the Czars. Oh. It's rich poop. Well, me not even. I mean, I mean, it's just, it's that old. That's all yeah. I'm saying. It's all techno poop because the uh, oh. charcoal. I mean, it it's just looks neon, like there's neon lights and <laughs> not really any stream anymore. It's yeah. dry mostly Good. with a small rivulet. I figured it'd be just pipes. No. No, Too they're old not for even that. pipes. They're old brick. Yeah. Well, if it's made in the modern day, it's a sewer, but the, the sewer Fred, is... Fred, what did I just say about timeline? He said hmm. from the SARS. SARS. Do you know when those Russian. people are? 1918 yeah. was the okay. last star. Yeah. And they yeah. did have pu plumbing they and did. pipes. Correct. Yeah, they, they did. did. But it so was that's why I was saying. Concrete, but but like a lot of stuff lime. like this yeah. would probably have just been stone because they're like, we got to get down there and work well, on it. So the, the, the piping would be to the reservoir. We're, we're in the reservoir. Mm. The, Pretty the much. large stone area mm. where the water would have gone through. We're, in the, we're near the cesspool, mm. though. Yeah. The cistern. Yeah. yeah, yeah, that's the word I meant to say. Yeah, and there is what looks like a passageway to get further down. Yeah, well, I'm gonna, so yeah. probably the outlet that led to wherever it dumped. Yeah. Yay. Do we need a navigation or tracking? I don't know what. Um, is it, it find? Would I don't be remember. Find. Find. It would be fine. And I will give you a plus two bonus because you know where you're supposed to be going. Okay. I'm awesome. Let me see so if there's actually fourteen. So plus there two to be. the total or plus two to the roll? Apparently, oh, Wade doesn't. Total? No. Okay. It would actually be survival. The Which I have. Survival. Oh, I have survival. Excellent. It would be plus two to the total because okay. that's how this works. Okay, then I probably would have rolled. Seventeen. So. Yeah. 17 is 4, so 14, 15, 16. Uh, Usagi has a 17. Okay. Uh, I'll, uh, I will need to use a... I mean, I'll tell you right now, Fred, at this point, there's enough success. You don't need to roll anything. You okay. can take that back. Okay. Right. Yeah. You know where you're going. People so know where you're our, going. Our successes means you can't just get lost. Yeah. That's We're like... Right Wait, stop. It's not Stop Wade, going left, L. man. It's not the labyrinth. It's a no, straight line. I would, it would have been just... It, it would have been, been L. Oh, L. oh okay. Wade oh, yeah, no. It, she's used to, like, navigating by stars and shit. And this Wade is, doesn't have survival. So yeah, so know. she's like, I, I, I don't well, so, know. Yeah, and survival like, mine. That way. It's not great for you, but it's also... You can use it on so dreams. See that big hole over there? We're going in that big yeah. hole. We're, we're, we're looking for ladders. It's going to be a ladders. big tunnel, and we're just following it. Yeah, we're looking for ladders. Once we get the ladders, yeah, it's not even we're looking for ladders. It's yeah. we're going that way until it ends. Yeah, because that's what puts you as close as you can get using this. Okay. Yeah. And I mean, yeah, ten. <clears throat> excuse me. It it takes a good. Let's see, three miles an hour. Yeah, about two yeah. hours, twenty minutes, two and a half hours to get. At, at, that's reasonable. And we we could you could even say it was shorter be, or took longer because we were being careful it totally understandable I, again like i said it's like about three miles 
just average speed, yeah. Yeah. average human speed. Yes, I'm sure you're probably going. What was that noise? Every oh, so yeah. often. Oh, is that, is that the, the Earth is growing. But, yeah. No. So, let's make it three hours flat. Okay. okay. And, and yeah, what, what time of the day out. was it when we left the professors? I mean, it was still before noon, so it was still okay. morning. Okay. So but worst case, it were like afternoon. Miserable battle, kind of right. threw everyone for a loop. Yeah. We just don't want to be stuck outside at dark. Yeah. It's, no. You're not going to be stuck outside. It's probably okay. about noon when you exit. Perfect. And I mean, it has gotten more water in it over time, but it's not the filth water you would expect. It just seemed like. Yeah, there's probably some underground streams that fed into it. Xavier literally doesn't care. <laughs> I know. But everyone else, and you, it still smells like a sewer. Yeah, I mean, to be fair, he wishes he could smell as I, bad I, as it would be. Everyone else can smell. Yeah, I'm being nice and not telling him, give me a strength check <laughs> to not vomit. Because I'm like, it's been abandoned for a while. Valid. So the smell lingers. Probably forever. Yeah. But Poop it's not like... Poop and crested walls? Yeah. It's not overpowering, like, okay. in use. Which makes me wonder any why anybody wants to go into the Parisian catacombs. I have no idea. Like, well... Yeah. It's the stench of death. There's no more... You can't smell the, the bones or anything like that anymore. Anyway, but yeah, you come back out, your phone gets signal again, and you're very easily able to look around and be like, oh, it's that way, about two more miles. Okay. Who is it in the Cyrillic? Do you read Cyrillic? I don't read Oh, no, Cyrillic. you do like a Google Translate. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, his phone is set to English. Oh, that's fair. Oh, it <laughs> auto translates. I, I do. Yeah. I have websites like that. Yeah. Yeah. This is. You don't know what that techno demon did to his phone, but. Oh, that's fair. Whatever he did, his phone works great. That's right. It's just. Never mind. He, he has an AI guard dragon, okay? <laughs> it's secretly one of those game rigs. Yeah. Well, we all know the language of techno dragons are, is Cyrillic. <laughs> 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 Sorry. <laughs> No, I just won't play Shadow Run in Tharkhold. I mean, if you really look at it, Tharkhold is Shadow Run. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Not as much magic in Tharkhold, but. True. Well, a lot, a lot of psionics, yeah. Yeah, more psionics, less magic, but. Yeah. I'm sorry. A, a street samurai troll. Would not feel out of place in Tharkold. Correct. He'd be like, what is this weird place? Oh, look, they're racing and shooting at each other. I can deal with this. I could be a demon. I'll be a minotaur, but I'll be a valor without the wings. <laughs> <laughs> but, I mean, Anyways, yeah, you, uh, how close it, to your it friends? Be, Shadowrun would understand Tharkold. Yeah. Well, about two miles. Oh, wonderful. Um, and I mean, I it seen looks like three more years, so. country and fields, long grass. So, how do we emerge? Are we emerging from like a culvert or like? Oh yeah, like yeah, a it's not wide a culvert. Or a it's manhole. an old kind of. It looks like an old bridge. Oh okay. That it's not a bridge. Uh, like, yeah, that's yeah. What, it looks like an old archway. Yeah, okay. like a dump runoff. And okay. it kind of it comes into a river. Awesome. So, I mean, yeah, there's a river there, but there's also stairs leading up. Okay. Why is your eye twitching like that? His chair squeaked at a frequency that was high enough that really irritated my eye. <laughs> my chair squeaked? Yeah, like ultrasonic high frequency, really? and I heard it, and I was like, ah! It's like, I didn't hear a thing. <laughs> Casey saw my eye twitch, though. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I did. Because it was like, that's like an eye twitch of like, I'm really annoyed. And it, it was I'm really annoyed. Sure. It's just, it's I thought he in, was really annoyed at me. It's involuntary. Sorry. <laughs> no, no, I'm not mad. I'm just like, 
are you mad that I put stairs there? No, no. I have a, when we were doing the house stuff, uh, the frequency of a shovel hitting a stone and then oh, scraping on it right. yeah. makes me nauseous. Yep. And we were, that's what we were doing for the last three weeks of just doing Don't that. Stop. Stop. Cause it has the same effect on oh. me of, Yep. Nails on chalkboard. Oh, yeah, no. Don't like, don't even describe it. I wasn't going to describe understand. it. No, I, was, I wasn't going to describe it. I was like, there were times where I'm sitting there just going. Yeah, but you're talking about shuddering. it. Yeah. Oh, and okay. it's making me shudder oh, because oh, I know yeah, that okay. sound. Okay. And it does that to me. <coughs> um, uh, survey the area. Okay. Uh, yeah, like I said, there's a river. How? What's I, the light like? It. Uh, there's a couple clouds, but mostly it's just a hill. Alan will dis it's not discharge hills, his conjuration. It's just okay. it looks like a grassy area. Okay, kind of like yeah, ru Russian. It's an open yeah. field that we have no cover to hide behind. No, there it's comes not the that. Dragon. <clears throat> it's like what we see. It's like right out yeah. here. Yeah. Yeah. Except left to itself for about a year yeah not quite a year so yeah there's all kinds of plants but they're not tall tall that's fine Do so the map i can okay continue i just follow the map okay so how are you doing this that, that's my oh, stealthily yes <laughs> okay so i need survival rolls and stealth rolls. all right survival Ooh, that 20 on a stealth? Or survival, sorry. And then 11, so that's... 31? 31. 10. 10. So that's a 22. No, uh, it's 20. My survival. <laughs> I'm not going to bother Regardless, doing the math you, then. you pretty much looked at the phone, examined the area, and you're like, oh, it's that way. <laughs> 14 <sighs> minus... I, I'm not even going to make you roll a second survival to try. Oh, this is stealth. Yeah. 11 stealth. That, that, what I'm saying is you rolled well enough. You're like, it's that direction. You have your okay. uh, terrain feature that you're like, okay, see that there, that mountain? It's there. Yeah. I'm, I'm locked in. All right, I'm going to spend a possibility on my stealth. Four stealth for Usaki. Okay. Oof. 11 for um, Alan. Okay. The minimum 10s in Tharkold, right? Yes. For, okay, so that's 16. So three, that's a 15 total. Six stealth. Jesus. I rolled a... Uh, I mean, I get it. Cause Better you guys, than Usagi. You guys can still smell the poo. <laughs> I rolled a... Xavier's like, what's wrong? <laughs> I rolled a three. Yeah, it happens. Yeah, I just like Usagi because she's illusionist. Doesn't look like she's covered in anything. Yeah. Oh, I know. I remember... Uh, I don't remember. Eric would remember. And Eli got an 18. 50, yeah, 18. Nice. So. so I don't need to worry about survival then? No. No, he, I, I'm, yeah. He got it. I, I, I triangulated, like, he can see the legal area did. But a little, a little bit. I, I fore, foreshadowed it. I didn't, but I just rolled so you well. You five shadowed it. I'm a, hey, me better. I'm a, I'm a six shot. I'm a try. No, no, no. Try I'm gonna triangulate that foreshadow. I'm triangulating that foreshadow up on a five head with an eight track. Sorry, I didn't realize your mouth was so full. <laughs> That's what she said. Wait. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. I'm playing. I made a female uh, iron dwarf rogue. Yeah. For Mr. Pandari to play uh, with my friend Tony, and uh, God, I love how she looks. <laughs> I, I got to do the. I unlocked all the races, um, the variant ones, and I got to figure out. I got to get a Drenai to level sixty so that I can unlock the red Drenai. Oh, the Eridar? Yeah. I was, it, you look, it looks like Hellboy. I'm like, I want to be Hellboy now. Damn it. <laughs> I like the Drenai. Yeah. 
They have some well, like I have I have the, the blue and the the Lightbringer ones. They're both really cool. Lightbringer Paladin is so dumb. You're like holy and holy. Sure, it's great. I love it. But uh, I was like, I, I want to look when like I Hellboy. I was leveling mine. It was during one of the events where it was just basically run. Which Excuse one? Me. The forty man battleground. Do you guys want to take a ten minute break? Ba- not Arathi Basin. Um, um, what time is it? Yeah, we can take a 10-minute break. 10-minute break and 3-minute You know what? Ad? Yeah. So we will take a 10-minute break, and we will come yeah. back at 8.30. Okay. Thank you. Woo. Don't like that method. Yeah, we're working on it. <laughs> but we're welcome back. We are continuing with some Torg, and, and that's not the page I was on. But that might be a better option. Okay. So, you guys are assessing, are attempting to cross this area. Correct. High grass, right? Mostly high grass. There's a few copses of trees around. So, is that your way of asking, because with your three, like, she just... Dodges all the high grass. <laughs> she's oh, reverse she, raptoring she it. She really think, yeah, basically, she really <laughs> thinks she's being sneaky, and everyone's like, oh, "What are you she, doing?" She's literally going da 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 da, or what? What is uh, Pink Panther? Da da. I can't do that. Da 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 She's vocalizing. You're like, no wage following. Wade's arguing with L. No, L got really high in her role. Wade. Well, she's a woman. She can argue with you and still be stealthy. (laughs) (laughs) So, as as you approach this larger copse of trees, might even also it might actually class as a small forest. Okay. But the trees shudder. And this Balrog comes creature up. comes out of it, you and you stand there and running. look at it for a second, because it looks very much like a bear in most regards. Oh crap! Except you can smell that it's probably dead. Oh no! And there are cybernetic attachments on it. It is now combat. It's laser bear. <coughs> okay. uh, and everyone test willpower. Okay. Okay. Is this a fear effect? This is a fear effect. Thank you. Is this a standard or dramatic? This is only a standard. Okay. The name of this card is called Unworthy. Any villain. Who has suffered one or more wounds suffers another wound. The heroes have initiative. The villain is stymied. The approved action is attack and taunt. Yep. Okay, so that's a two. Oh, that don't work. Um, Wolf, or yeah, Wolf Power. Alan. Okay. So 17 willpower. 11, okay. 11 willpower for Alan. Okay. No. <laughs> Worse. Willpower is mine, right? With a spirit. Nine. For Usagi. Okay. Usagi is very... St- very stymied. Very stymied? Crap me. She better burn. I'm going to burn a... <clears throat> Is it a one or... It's a two. Okay. <laughs> so long as it isn't a one. Wade's got 
Okay. And she got a 14. 14. Okay. <clears throat> so, <laughs> everyone but Usagi is like, oh, ooh, that's horrible, but I can deal with it. What? Since the heroes have initiative... Alan pulls out his mask, <laughs> snaps it on his head, and says, Behold, a mystery as deep as the Turkey Bacon Club, which is neither a tool to beat your enemies, nor a place to dance. I am the obfuscated object of mystery. <laughs> did he send that to you? Yes, he did. <laughs> so I laughed. Alan. And uh, thank goodness. Because it's even funnier. <laughs> Neil! I played my Cosm card. At any time for the rest of the scene, intimidation is favored. Oh. Okay. Okay, that's um. How far away is this bear? Or the cyber bear. The bear, bear, bear? Yeah. <laughs> it's actually not too far away because you were the passing fairly close to these trees. Bear, bear, that's aware yeah. of the bear, bear. <laughs> um, I'm trying to read how magic works. Okay. Yeah. Uh, as your standard action, your one action, you basically yeah, yeah. choose a spell to cast. He's stymied. So my question is, how far away is he? What's the meters? Um... You asked that question. I'm sorry, About I didn't hear the five. answer. Five. Five. Five meters? Yeah. Jesus. It's close. Like I said, no, you're no, no, valid, passing valid. very close to no, this. No, we rolled a three and a six. I get it. <laughs> yeah. <coughs> All right. Um, Alvin continues and he goes, Behold the blue bands of Bastet! Please roll the one. <laughs> Thanks, Casey. I appreciate you too. I want to use the Cosm card. I know, and I don't want you to use the Cosm card. Conjuration 12. I have 12. this book. Conjuration 12. <laughs> so. He definitely makes it 14. <laughs> uh, so he d he's able to do the skill. Right? Yeah. yeah. But what's their dexterity or dodge? I think it's a... It's a 14 against their dexterity or dodge. So it's yep. a success against this. Okay. okay. So they are currently constricted and they are stymied and vulnerable. Okay. So they're very stymied. It doesn't scale. It, uh, are you sure? Yeah. I thought if you had two sources of stymied, you were very stymied. Brian's not here to look up the rules. That's fair. Um. What made it stymied the first time? The card, the card gives them stymied. Oh. Yeah, they're stymied at the yes, start. Yes, it does. Stack. Yeah, that, I'm, that's why I was like... I'm fine with that. <laughs> yeah, it does stack. Yeah. So if they're stymied and another stymied yeah. is applied, the, they the become The only varied. reason I know that is because I was vulnerable and then vulnerable again, and I was very vulnerable. I was like, shit. <laughs> <laughs> so if something is vulnerable yep. or stymied and a new one is applied while that one is yeah. in effect, it goes to the next stage. But there's no stage higher than that. It's yeah. just f plus four or minus four. And that's, that's his it. action. Yeah. Okay. Um, shit. I should, I should have. Uh, so I'm going to intimidate it. Okay. And we'll see if it's immune to it. And I know that most undead are immune, but we'll find out. Um, was Xavier there for the T-Rex? He was. Mm. Yes. 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 Oh, would he? Uh, would I waste it though? Nah, I screwed. I I used the comic card. Let's go. So I'm going to. I know it isn't dark, but I'm going to use the shadows and try to. Woo! And we'll find out real quickly if this undead slight. Well, you know. Speaking of undead bear, anybody seen Annihilation? Jesus. Oh my gosh. <laughs> mm. <sighs> Favored. 
Well, the six and then a nine. I'll take that though. Um, I will. Uh, I'll spend a possibility. So 20 total is 7 plus 12. 19. Uh, dinky, 19. Okay, that is a good success. Nice. So, so he is now very both. Okay. Okay, Wade's going to hockey stick yeah. time. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah, you do, Wade. And you got a four-point swing. I'm sorry, eight-point swing. <laughs> Jesus. Depends on how well my dice like me. That's true. That is very true. Oof. Not very much. <laughs> Are you spending yours or hers? Mine. Hers is right there. Okay. Beautiful. So I'm looking up a perk. Um, don't forget to put a par card in your... Yes. 14. All right. Minimum 10. So what are you up to? Uh, I'm at night 24. Oh, nice. 24. That's an eight. Okay. That's eight plus. Uh, oh. Twenty-four. Twenty-eight. No, sixteen plus eight is twenty-four. Twenty-four. And you're it's very vulnerable, so you get a plus four. Oh yeah, twenty-eight. <laughs> oh, and it's large, so that's another plus two. So it's Jesus. thirty. 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 <laughs> 30. <laughs> okay, well, before we added everything in, it was already outstanding. So. Good night. There you go. So two dice. Two, two extra dice. dice. Two bonus dice. Unless you have, like, was it? Oh, no, you have to determine all out attack. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Six, you roll again, right? Yep. So yep. It becomes a it's five. A five, and, you roll and you roll again in it. So five, eight, ten. Plus? Uh, plus two. No, strength oh, plus no. two. No. Strength. strength plus two. What's your strength? Uh, nine plus two. So 11, 11 plus 10, 21. 21. 21. <laughs> it's been a while. It's valid. Yeah, no, it's valid. okay. It is fair. 21 with your Is there sticker. any AP on that? It's a hockey stick. No. Okay. I need to ask. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. It's a hockey stick. Yeah, we, have, we, we haven't it's gotten Kim back yet stick. to magic it into a one AP <laughs> hockey stick. Okay, but. 21. I don't know how you would do that. You I have runes. You just enchant the wood. Uh, yeah, yeah, I have runes. That's why my claws yeah. are AP. No, we, we've we, talked we, about it. <laughs> we, we, I don't know how Wade would do it. Yes, he's Kim forward. would mark Kim the card would mark yeah. Is Kim here? No, I'm no, saying no, that's, that's why that's he said. Why it. I said, why I said I here. wish Kim was here. Yeah, because yeah. Kim could do it. To yeah. could mark up your thing. <laughs> but right okay. now, and yeah, you smack this thing pretty good, and you hear a pretty good crack. Oh yeah, and it, it, it's I that wasn't cybernetic now looks. Bad, so you're pretty sure you fractured the skull. Dang. Okay. It's still standing. It, 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 Give the man a card. The destiny card. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah. That's a successful yep. attack. Yep. I was confused. You're right. I went one. Oh yeah. Throw into your pool, Fred. Yeah. Yep. And then L. L is going to pull out her. Blessed Bone Forge Club and do the same thing. Yeah, work together. It's 14. 14 is a one. 1. And 23. That would be 15. Uh, plus oh. 4, so 19. 19. Plus 2, 21. <laughs> yeah. Does a 21 make it outstanding? No. Would a 24 make it outstanding? 24 wood. Then I'm going to play supporter because I want the lovers to just. Oh, what's okay, what's so the, the two hockey kids in, in uh, that is Dogma? That's not what I was thinking of, but sure, yeah. Oh, you know that. You're going to Eiffel Tower the better. Yeah. Wow, well, oh my God. <laughs> Stop it, Jeremiah. We're going to get that's canceled. Awful. Oh. I mean, you're not. Don't Xavier is French that enough to, that that's valid, but whoa. <laughs> yeah, no, whoa. So, yeah, that is now outstanding, and that is two bonus day. Well, I also want to talk, like, that's the thought process. I would do. like, if yeah. you're doing something inappropriate, and then he went, like, hockey sticks, and I was like, like, the, 
Emilio Estevez uh, Ten, film. Uh, seven, uh, seven, Mighty Ducks. Mighty Ducks. The two plus, kids there, and then you're like, um, Dogma. And I'm like, well, that we that was a weird arc. So just strength. Strength is her strength is ten plus four. Oh, so is blessed. Four. Oh my God, thirty one. So Ooh. he rolled, yeah, two yeah. sixes. He rolled a seventeen on the on the bonus die plus ten, which is twenty seven plus four for her blessed. Yeah. My yeah. goodness. Thirty one. Wow. My, I thought wait wait was like dude, dude. <laughs> She's like, hold my beer. Right? <laughs> oh, my goodness. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> Xavier's like, I'm so 31. happy to be incorporeal right now. <laughs> wow, that. That's Kim level, dude. Good for that you. Yeah. Kim level. <laughs> Jesus. Cause that... Where were you guys? Oh, they ran away. I was like, where were you guys when we fought the dragon? They you're, booked it. You're like, it. Wade was like dead and she ran away. Shit. <laughs> she ran away first. I yeah, run. she did run away. Wow, she that just... Is it like four wounds? I Three wounds. Oh. That does three wounds. Good night. Good for her. Wow. I mean, Good for her. She is just... it still up? No. <laughs> <laughs> it is not. That's at least I, five I, wounds. I was getting to... No, that's not five. That's only no, I mean, four. He yeah, only he did one. one. He said Jesus. he just did, like, uh, context. Context. No, he that, only did fine. one wound. That's fine. I just was... Yeah. And it is undead, so it doesn't take shock. Right. Okay. Okay. But, I mean, yeah, I was trying to go for context before Jeremiah. Is it still up? Sorry. <laughs> I'm getting to that. It anyway. is. It's still up. And? And she just comes around. I mean, she kind of does the whole spins on one foot and <laughs> brings her club down and connects right at the base of the mm. neck. And you just hear it snap and it head jerks back. Oh. And you just know there that the nerve cord severed. Wow. And it probably collapsed the... Brain stem as well. Yeah. Cerebellum? No. No, the brain stem. Yeah. She gets and this thing now. just goes completely <laughs> limp. Good for her. That was not what I was going to do. So it's blessed. Does her mace or club count as holy? It just is plus four and four club. Okay. I need to look that up. Because she, she may be able to kill me. <laughs> yeah, because it does actually work on uh, Supernatural Undead. Oh, yeah, that she oh. can definitely kill you. Yeah, yeah so not only... Uh, uh, I counted Supernatural Evil, so she'd get a, her uh, plus two against me, or plus one against me, and she bypasses my incorporealness. Yeah. She could, she could kill me. She could destroy like, just, you. For what, that, right. that, I, so I think I, I'm, I'm like <laughs> shaking a little bit. You're like just yeah. drinking the water. Well, I like because I imagine because it's blessed. I imagine she like there's a like a like, like a paladin thing, and it's just and I see like a, a flicker of light, and the ghost in me, the aurora in me, is like. <gasps> <laughs> Your butthole well, is here, here's the thing. butthole just scream. What the? F <laughs> it, it's not blessed by a good deity. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. I understand, but yeah. it's more like I, you yeah. know, the berserk. Oh yeah, yeah. So you know when he runs into the witch and she's handing out magic weapons. Yeah, and she tries to hand him the axe, and he's like, Nah, nah. And she's like, Wait, really? And then she looks at the sword. Yeah. It, 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 does he have the dragon sword like, at this point? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, this is he had. His, no, he doesn't have the. He, he just he has the has iron one. The iron one. The one with the soul, the souls in it. Yeah, yeah. It, it, it's more like you look at it, and her club's more like that. Yeah. Because it's blessed by a death god. Yeah. It's still blessed. It's still blessed, <laughs> and, and he, you're like, oh yes, that will affect me. He's yep. happy. <laughs> what just happened? He's happy. Uh, he yeah. is happy, but now we're going to be like weird things happening. Yeah. So she clubs this bear, and the body just goes completely limp. Oh, no. <laughs> Jeremiah's like, oh, no. You're right. Oh, no. Yep. Just 
and you Baymax. see oh no this you think it's it's tongue wiggles out of its mouth oh. and it's not a tongue oh. it's some kind of cybernetic what is wrong with you? <laughs> what is wrong that I like this <laughs> and you kind of get that oh, oh that's what was controlling this corpse and you two are still up no they went first I they thought. went yeah, first yeah, oh Alan, yeah they Alan did. yeah L Alan, was the last Alan, Alan went you two you two went we have not gone yet no we went Usagi, Usagi has, has, not, has gone. not gone. Oh, oh, Usagi saw something. Yeah, yeah. Right, Usagi yeah. has not gone. Yeah, I was... Alan went, and I, I intimidated. Oh, you intimidated? It, yes, he did. That's, that's what made true. it very Okay, angry. okay. And then um, they thumped it, and then Usagi has her... Um, Usagi has an action step. Yeah. And yeah, this cybernetic thing oh. just climbed oh, out of its mouth. Oh, she doesn't get cards, does she? No, no she okay. doesn't. Okay. I, just, I was just saying that to be facetious. She gets a card now. <laughs> but after that, she um, fucking deserves one. Here, she can have one of mine. Hey, don't Usagi looks at it and goes, Wow. You're not really good at this, are you? You can't even control a, an Ursarine long enough to be beaten the skull in by... But he's a 17-year-old kid. You're not good at this. I'm taunting. <laughs> Whoa! Yeah, you are. Is that a one? That's a zero, isn't it? I can't read it. <sighs> You're determined, and it'd be more funny. Oh, I'm looking at the wrong thing. If it fails, I don't have no problem. But this is kind of like she's snapping out of her funk. Good. Yeah. Uh, oh yeah, no, she's bolstered by what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, that's a lot of. Points. So my my question is, Nine. if it was piloting the bear, does, is it also now very very? Hmm. Or that was just the body that it was. That was okay. just the body it was in. Question: Is now it still just, stymied? This is now technically a new creature. That's fine. Is I, that creature stymied? Not very stymied, but still well, stymied. It should because, be because okay, it's okay, okay, okay. So yeah. I'm asking. Card is still in play. Okay. Correct. Yeah. So but the other stuff is not. So that's a minus two to. Its. That's a twenty-four taunt against oh, their charisma. Or willpower if they have no. No, it's no, or, or a taunt if it's higher, right? Yeah, charisma correct, or correct. taunt. Correct. If you thought really, Kim was a nightmare, really, Usagi, <laughs> Usagi does maneuvers. Listen, she yeah, that's that's all I can do. Yeah, maneuvers and precog. Okay, um, twenty what four? Four. And it's whatever minus two. I understand, and okay. I'm looking at this like. <sighs> well, and they can also be immune to certain. It's not. It isn't. Okay, okay. They literally give me the taunt skill. <laughs> that tells me not immune. Good. So, well, it doesn't. It, it means that they they can utilize it. Because. Sorry, continue. I was about to notify you of something. Continue. Oh, okay. Oh, no, I was. I was to say it that, does it, not uh, have anything that it is immune to. That's fine. Yeah, yeah, I don't have the stat block, so yeah. No, that's favored. Never mind. Oh, intimidating. I'm looking yeah. over here, like if it's approved, you get two destiny cards. But no, you just made it favored. Yeah. I mean, it does say oh, undead, right. and it does say breathing, eating, or other living processes. But I mean, taunting something doesn't require living; it requires Correct. intelligence. Correct. Yeah. Um, Sometimes. Yeah. Things yeah. that are immune to taunt are like undead that are mindless. Yeah. As mindless. we learned with the zombies. Yes. Yeah. This is not mindless. Right. And 24 is outstanding. Yeah. Well, you can also determine that it, like, I don't know what taunt does. I think it, is taunt one of those things where it can take it out of the fight? Yes. You can, yes. you can utilize that it doesn't, that not, nothing can take it out of the fight. So no, it no, just becomes. No. Uh, here, here's what I was going at. Okay. What he's going to tell me to do, it was probably already going to do. Because <laughs> he's probably going to say it is scared and runs away, and well, it was going to do that anyway if you Valid. let it. Valid. 
there's just a like a, a yellow and, and black slime trail. Well, no, yeah, it well, does, it's it's in Baldur's Gate. I'm thinking it, it's the the, oh. the 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 mind worm trying to get away. It's a, oh, yeah. Right. yeah. I mean, and like I said, if you're just trying telling me take it out of the fight, yes, okay, taking it out of the fight, take it out of the fight, no problem. It is burrowing because they can do that, Beautiful. and it is no longer a threat. Cool. For the moment. But we love reoccurring threats here. <laughs> Those are all good cards. Because, oh, yeah. So here, here's the picture. And it's if exactly. you look at the monkey in the upper left-hand corner, you'll see why I was laughing. Oh, okay. <laughs> Trade that. This cost me. Okay. And then discard down to four. I mean, everything in the picture looks cool, especially the bear, but... Just F those monkeys. <laughs> monkeys, man. They'll be a thing. Did, did I tell you to look really close at the one in the upper left corner? Yeah. It's flipping them off, isn't it? Or can I... No. Am I? Upper left? He's a fully cybernetic, terrifying nightmare there monkey. That red light. Oh, oh. A, okay. I wasn't thinking about that. That's fair. That's it's fair. supposed to be its navel. Yeah. But because of the way it's, it's bent, jumping. Yeah. It's jumping. It doesn't look like it's in the navel. So I was just like, you're like it's here's a terrifying origin. picture. I'm like, yes, yes, that's very terrifying. It's very terrifying. Until you look at that monkey and you see that red light and you're like, you should not have put it in that position. Okay. Right. Because it's like, yes, that's supposed to be the navel, but because of the way it's hunched, God. it doesn't look like it's in the navel. Okay. Was that the Cosm card? No. No? no. Okay. Oh, shit. All right. No, that was just us messing around and being stupid. That was me saying, you guys failed something badly enough, I should throw something at you. Yeah. <laughs> and what I was going to throw at you was far worse than this. But when it flipped to this page and I looked, I'm like, oh no, that would be more fun. That one? Me and uh, L high five. Yeah, you should. Yeah. 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 And, and I'm going to put a bit of distance between me and her. Mm-hmm. <laughs> What's wrong? <laughs> oh, uh, accidental motion range. Um, but uh, but I'll paint it as he's uh, the kind of guy that would bless his golf clubs. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, I'll paint it as uh, uh, respecting the the, the space, the boundary. Like, hey, hey, I get it, I get it, I, I know whose girlfriend she is. We're good. And then I'm like, I can see why. <laughs> you were forced. Are you okay? Do you need help? <laughs> Are you all right, Wade? <laughs> I'll play, I'll What's that twice. SNL skit where it's a uh, oh the guy? They, they, it's a it's a high schooler who slept with his teacher skit. And oh, like, uh, Pete Davidson. Yeah, Pete Davidson. He's like, high can, fives. You, can you? Like, can yeah, my wrist kind of hurts from all the high fives. And he's like, can you explain to us? The, the defendant, he goes, yeah, it's those two over there. Give me butterflies all day. And they're just like, stop it. And stop it. It's uh, Ronda Rousey and the uh, brown-haired girl yeah. that's on the, the cast. Yeah. yeah. Sicily, something Sicily. Yeah. Sicily. Okay. You know what I'm talking about. So those do still exist. Yes, they <laughs> do. For it. Yeah. Awesome. Buttworms, man. They're terrifying. I've got bumworms. Not as not as good as the ship has the herpes. Yes. <laughs> and to this day, I cannot figure out how it is such a terrible, awful thing. Herpes? The what? ship herpes. 
Oh, okay. <laughs> I was I was a little confused. I was I, I was writing and I got no context and I was like herpes. I'm like whoa 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 what happened? <laughs> We were talking about them getting lucky, but geez. You gonna get techno herpes? <laughs> yeah, dude, techno herpes, man. That's the worst. Right. That we, like, <laughs> you get herpes, it's like neon lights. <laughs> I mean, I could get that, but I think I think the worst place to get an STD would be in our Roche. Yeah, yeah. Where your dick falls off and turns into something that attacks you. Like I was gonna say worm. ghost genitalia or like anytime you need oh to go to the bathroom, it goes, God. ooh. <laughs> <laughs> well it didn't but it does now <laughs> my god you said that and i was thinking of a scene from that movie ghost ship oh, oh yeah where where the oh, singer god. chick was seducing the black dude mm -hmm. that was i don't know awful. what happens because i can't make it past the first five minutes oh the the, the trip first line? opening scene the trip line you can't get past it i i get it i'm the fact, yeah, her surviving somehow makes it scarier. Right? Have you seen Ghost Ship? So good. Scary. The yes. first five minutes is classified as one of the most terrifying scenes in like the top yeah. ten of ever terrifying scenes. Like, we're talking like Hellraiser, Alien kind of thing. It's up there trying to think there's not a lot of horror that really throws you that no, fast no that deep. no 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 like i'm sure there's a couple out there what happens is they're all dancing on this they're, ship they're on a cruise ship and there's a wire tightening in the wrong and it just tightens it, too it, much no 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 it, it's not it, it's, oh. no it's it's they a it's a guard it. wire that is built around and it's uh bolted down and the bolt comes free so the wire starts to shift and eventually it clears the deck and, and they're all dancing, and, and they're so they're all cut in half, and it's just above her head. She's dancing with the yeah, captain. Yeah, this, this little and she's girl. She's the only one that survives, and head. they're all cut off at the chest. And like some of them are like, well, to like... it's not just the chest because yeah. the well, captain height gets cut stuff. off. Yeah, yeah, there. yeah. But I'm, yeah. but it, they're all at her height. Yeah, yeah just it's above uh, her head. the she's entire the premise is there is this cursed gold. Yeah, and there are these hell spirits that secreted onto a ship. And then tell people about this gold, and the crew of the ship basically murders everyone on the ship right. to get the gold. Mm -hmm. I think I've seen part of it. Or... Most people have seen that first scene, yeah, in yeah. some form it's... or another. Because oh, of it is it's... gruesome. It's yeah, it is gruesome. Like it's got to be up there with the most viewed horror scenes, mm -hmm. like with the the. The, the chest burster. The chest yeah. burster, the, the blood uh, elevator from Shining. Okay, I was like, the blood elevator? That sounds awesome. Yeah. Oh, yeah, no, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, I haven't watched Shining either. I mean, you're I've not seen missing parts much. Of it. Yeah, yeah, that one is a the, really The Shining slow... is good psychologically, psychologically, but it has like four really like holy shit moments. See, my yeah. second ex wife was really into horror movies, so I watched like The Ring. And I, yeah, I, I <laughs> the, so, the whole scene of in The Shining where he's like, here's Johnny. Johnny. It was, yeah, they didn't prepare Shelley Long for that. She nope. was legitimately she was screaming yeah. her off because well, she's just like. So, yeah, she didn't know the door was a prop door and that Jack was going to come through with, with an axe. Oh. And so he does. she's six inches away from the axe when he puts it through. So that's all real, and she's oh. yeah, oh, yeah. No, she had PTSD after that. She had like, oh, I mean, yeah. they had to pay for like six months of therapy. Oh yeah, valid. It's a good <laughs> film because it's of it. It's an amazing film, yeah. Yeah, no. But no, my, um, my the most anyway. terrifying scene for me, I have to do this, is the daughter of ashes in fourteen oh eight. It's an entirely oh. alternate ending. Oh. Where he's hugging his daughter, the it only just begun, and she turns the ash in his arms. And at the very end, he's like with his ex-wife and he's listening to the recordings from room 1408. And you hear his, oh, I'm getting fucking choked. Oh. You hear his daughter go, daddy, on the tape. And it, oh, whoo, whoo. 
every single hair, man. It's okay. It's okay. Yeah. Mine yeah. Too. <laughs> 1408. That's the one that's the motel room. Yeah. yeah. With, uh, they, but it's John they, Cusack. It's the paranoid. Yeah. And... yeah. The best part. He's a paranormal investigator. He's like, hey, that's not he's real. He gets there. He's like, yeah. Oh, this yeah, is. And yeah. Samuel L. Jackson is the is hotel the, manager. The, yeah. And he is uh, doing everything. You don't well, want to be in that room. There's a yes. There, there's a variant that. too. Uh, I'd say a variant. I haven't seen all where of Where he's that. actually one of the ghosts. Like he's not real. He's just somebody who interacts with John Cusack. There's like four alternates as far. Man, it's so good. It's so good. We are so off. Topic. That's fine. Yeah. We're talking about terrifying things because we, we are ghost dick. Yeah, and then also, so also the scariest movie for me is White Noises, with yeah because I'm deaf. Yeah, you know, you know. It's it, EVP is the scariest mm-hmm. thing to me. We're done with this conversation. <laughs> because we've had we have baby monitors. Yeah. That have pictures. Josh, yeah, Josh, I know. Josh. I know. I know. I'm not. I know. Oh. oh. <laughs> no, it's like, like well, uh, let's uh, stop because we're starting to get yeah. to where it's like. I watched a show. It was a called. Real, it's like real estate, about haunted real estate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And this ghost actually was haunt called these people. To sell the house yep. because, because he didn't like the Yeah, he doesn't like, like the new oh. tenant. He's like, get these people out. <laughs> so my question I have is, this dead bear thing, when the thing that came out of its mouth went away, does it still have cybernetics? The bear itself? Um, yeah, but... They're probably jumbled. <laughs> no, no, no. Like The reason I ask is, like, was it was, did like this tongue thing infect it and like cyber enhance it oh i know like borg style yeah right i, I mean I it, you think so because okay bears aren't naturally cybernetic well I mean, all, all i can think of is as soon as the tongue came out of the pair eli goes holy shit <laughs> yeah i i don't even think uh, after that critical hit i don't even think xavier noticed the tongue he was just like oh l <laughs> I'll probably notice the tongue come out and she goes, holy shit. It reminds me of the scene from any D&D. There, but there's a D&D episode where it's like, oh, hey, yeah, you, you're a barbarian. Totally. It's like, you kill the guy in one hit, you crit 148 damage, you slice his head off. You're like, yeah. The body falls out, the brain rolls over, and legs pop out. <laughs> <laughs> Time to run. <laughs> power. Well, that, but then it starves because yeah. it's a barbarian. Yeah. <laughs> That's my favorite scene in, in the uh, DMV Honor of Books Thieves. Yeah. Where it just walks by and he's like, rude. <laughs> well, that's kind of disheartening. <laughs> yeah. I love Chris Pine so much. <sighs> no, that was... He did a good job in that film. He did a good film. job in that film. <laughs> so good. And, I, I and not so a, did Michelle yeah. Rodriguez. Yes. Yeah. Yes. She did good. And Bradley Cooper as the halfling. <laughs> Her love interest. Oh, yeah. And she hits on the halfling at the end. Yeah. Yeah. It's good. Okay. Ah, uh, good stuff. Oh, man. Okay, so how... This little tiny forest that's not a copse of trees. Yeah, we still, we still how, have to... How far away are we theoretically from... Um, I think you're he's probably like, about half a mile away. Yeah. Okay. Uh, give me a find check. Okay. Find check. Okay, she explodes. Right, oh. So. Great. Minus two. That is two. Twenty-two find. Okay. Twelve. Who was that? That was Alan got a four. Twenty-one find. Usagi got a seven. That That was what? That was Wade. Okay, Wade. Thank you. I got a twenty and a ten. Okay. Nice. Uh, eleven or whatever. I got an eight. Okay. So I mean, Wade actually can look, looks, and he's like, "Oh, look, there's a heat shimmer there." Where it's like, you know, the ground is heating differently there than the ground, and you can see just a little bit of shimmer in the air. And he's like, "Yeah, that that's got to be it right there, over there. We're we're pretty close." Okay. If we hustle, we'll be there ten minutes. Okay, let's get over there then. You can't hustle. No more uh, uh, weird techno tongues. But yeah, yeah, yeah. Get there and you're like, oh. 
It's on fire. It's not on fire. It, it looks kind of like a fortress right now. Oh, that makes sense. <laughs> um, uh, your buddy's name was Ivan. Okay. <laughs> Ivan. Oh, yeah, such a That's, good, such a good line. Well, it's not Igor, so I'm now proud that I didn't just call it Igor. Quip, knock on the door. <laughs> oh, you don't have to knock. There's actually someone on the wall looking at you and watching you approach. <laughs> hey, is Ivan in? <laughs> I'm gonna use that trick. Hey, so we're here to see Ivan. Yeah, I mean, you kind of yell that from. <laughs> is John here? More or less, as far away as you can. I don't want to get shot at. <laughs> they, I, I understand. So it's like you see him looking at you, and you see they have a rifle. They haven't unslung it yet. When you yell, "Hey, is Ivan in?" and they kind of stop. And I say I was They like, turn say something into the compound. And then they look at you. They still haven't unslung their rifle yet, so you're feeling like that's a good sign right now. <laughs> but it takes about a minute or two. Oh, man. And someone comes up on the wall. And yells something, and his voice sounds familiar. Hey, did you ever get that whatever? The package well, is in I mean, yeah, he's still speak. They're speaking Russian. Yeah. He, well, he doesn't speak Russian. He goes, hey, I, did you I get know. that package I sent you? And the guy, this, the newcomer kind of stops. Kind of picks his head up and starts looking. And you see him cup his hand and yell, That you, Wade? Yep, it's me. I thought we'd come by for a visit. <laughs> you picked a hell of a time, you damned American. Yeah. But he start, he like, turns and starts. Yeah, we, we thought we'd he, lo he looks like he's happy, but he's yeah, definitely what, talking to movie? this person on the Where wall. Where the Chinese and the Russians invade America <sighs> with Patrick Swayze. Uh, Red Dawn? Yeah, we're reverse Red Dawn. Pretty much, that was just the Russians in that one. Yeah, whatever. Well, the, the remake. No, no, I'm sorry. It, you're, Russian, you're correct. The, it is Chinese in the in the remake, in the but I was one. thinking of the of the Fallout. Yeah, Fallout. Yeah, because yeah, that's how. Yeah, Chinese. Yeah. yeah. But anyways, right? We're yeah, we're reverse Red Dawning. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you're not wrong. Not entirely. <laughs> However, though. Well, Xavier's young enough to make the reference. Yeah. If Kim was here, they'd probably bring out nukes. If, yeah. <laughs> well, if Kim is here, he'd still be fighting the bear. Gee, <laughs> better help the bear. <laughs> if you see me fighting a bear in the woods, you better help the bear. Apparently. <laughs> Christ. <laughs> what the heck is that from? <laughs> it's a, a yeah. meme. I don't, know, I don't know the exact connotation, but <laughs> have you not heard of it? No. Oh. Oh, I'm sorry. No, don't, no, look no, it up. don't look it up. Yeah. Uh, I'm right just now. thinking of He's great outdoor. Oh, yeah, he's the outdoors. one that's got to do all the role play right now, so. Yeah, yeah, yeah it's me. Can we come? <laughs> he's, he's, uh, he's like, yeah, yeah, come, come. Okay. We have vodka. Ooh. Awesome. <laughs> Not that crappy stuff he stole the, when we were in high school. Yeah, mystical freestyle. Aren't you still in high school? Not well, anymore. I guess not. <laughs> Never mind. How's your mom? Kobe Bryant. Native. I'm not sure what that means. I don't know. We'll what talk mean? about it <laughs> yeah. over a bottle. Come, come. Introduce me to your friends. Yeah, okay. So Kobe, Kobe's but yeah, they, they him because that's nine years ago. Don't open the gate, but they have a okay. door but down yeah, yeah. It, it's in a the rapper. gate yeah. that they open for you song and let you in. See me in the forest fighting the bear. And yeah, Come Ivan okay. comes down and slaps an arm around you. Hand you a bottle of vodka. Uh, that's for Don. He takes a slug directly from the bottle and then hands it to you. I take another slug with two. And he starts yelling wanna, in Russian. Might want to warn your friends. Oh, yeah. These are my friends. Don't oh, shoot them. Oh, mystical. Em. Okay. 
And I introduced my friends. Okay. So I ain't like, no vodka for the ghost. Yeah, Ivan is like, I see this war has made strange company for you as well. Yeah, it's... Yeah. I'll yeah. admit, I've never seen a ghost before. I mean, to be fair, neither had I before I became one, so... I guess he we, has... Li- a- we live in interesting times, comrade. We do. I guess he has unfinished business. I do. <laughs> you wouldn't happen to have a, a way to get in contact with Isle, would you? Um, we do not. Oh, shame. Did I really fall into a semi-Russian accent? Yes, you did. <laughs> I mean, I don't know if you fell into it. More like you tripped a little bit. <laughs> it's <laughs> true. I did stumbled. Kind of trip, I mean, you drank that vodka pretty goddamn quickly, so... <laughs> Let me go home and grab my five wives vodka. Hmm. I don't know. Hmm. I've never had No, vodka. we got five husbands vodka. That's what we got. Because okay. they gave it to my wife as a gift. But the, you were there at the housewarming gift. I don't think anybody drank any, but we, it was given to us. I don't know. Again, I'm not, I've never had vodka myself. Really? Really. Oh. I don't no, know. don't say you need to have some. No, no I, I don't. No, I, what, listen, we are in Utah. I, I assume most people don't drink. But you know that's not true of me. I, I Correct. I think we've... We had mead together before? Yeah. I could have sworn we did, yeah. Cause we yeah. definitely had mead at, at like Bloat and Sumble. Yeah, you brought me a mead when we were yeah. at Jason's. Yep. Mead you made. Which we have three gallons... We just were they're cold crashing and we got to bottle them, so okay. you have to come over for that. We uh, got a lawnmower and a oh, weed whacker, so my backyard is good. Yeah, right. Yeah, no, like I was following the conversation, and you said lawnmower and weed whacker, and it threw. I was yeah, like, so what so kind my of backyard is, is that. <laughs> <laughs> like no, like that was my thought process. It's Danny Lion. It's the last Danny. It's a lawnmower. It's, a, it's the last Danny Lion meat of the season. <laughs> See the guy that made uh, meat out of Mountain Dew. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. listen, I follow him on TikTok. Yeah, he's I've a fantastic. Cool. I love what his um, stuff. There's is also really... a gentleman who does. He mixes candy with alcohol. So oh, he did. Well, I think it was like something sour and absinthe, and he drank it, and he goes, "Nope, that's vile. Nope." <laughs> he, go, he drank it and went. He was like, "Nope, nope, nope." <laughs> but then no, he also just... did. He did rum, Malibu rum, and Werther's. Oh, oh yeah. I was like, even people would be good. Yeah, I was like, We're people, just... even people who don't drink are like, oh. Well, like, yeah. like a butterscotch. Yeah, that's why, that's why you saw the 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 look of confusion yeah. on my face. He's like, a lawnmower because. So no, I valid. I went on, on a kind of I, I met, I was, retreat this last week. So before I get cut off again, that was my way my of bad. saying my backyard is done. I can now set up my grill and I can oh. invite people over for steak. And then okay. if it cases at my house, you can have some meat. Okay. Yeah. Anyways, yeah. So you no, were saying? So like I've, I've been to like three bars this weekend. Bars? Bars. Because oh, okay. Because that's where the, all the good food is. I went to oh, yeah. No. The other day. Oh. And like so they had, they're they having a cactus yeah. kick right now. And so everything with like agave and like yep. it was like prickly pear and stuff like that. So like when you said blue, blue nectar, lawnmower yeah. and like oh sure weed whack, and I was like oh yeah, this is the name of an alcohol. I'm fine with that. <laughs> <laughs> just... Well, the, well, there's a what grasshopper. So a lot. Yeah. I mean, we yeah, I don't know what weed whacker would taste like. I mean, lawnmower might be like a, <laughs> a edge trimmer. Well, like a like a what's the what's the green liqueur, creme de menthe and something else. I don't think don't I don't have a clue. I don't know. I have a bad liver. Yeah, it's fine. Yeah. Uh, anyway, uh, yeah, Ivan is basically introducing you around. This is also Ivan. This is my grandfather, Ivan. This is my brother, Ivan. This is my mother, Ivan. Ivana. <laughs> no, her name's Ivan. Ivana. <laughs> is my cousin, Ivanov. <laughs> Ivan of what? Ivanov Ivinsky. <laughs> <laughs> But, he's okay. Yeah, he's, like, he's like, come, come, let us have a drink. Yeah, that's Do you I'm... drink? Oh, I, I, no, I, I almost went into the Russian accent. <laughs> no, no, I can no longer invite. No, um, I, I, I cannot. <laughs> no, uh... Some odd reason. We just all. Uh, Usagi yeah, just goes, yes, poor. <laughs> yes. Usagi needs. <laughs> he, I was like, Usagi he, needs to pour one out for. He poor. The... He can. Oh, she, yeah. And she's just like. 
just like what you do with it's a vodka. Open. Just, <laughs> yeah. Oh, she, it's open. And she's like, yeah. He, she she still had flicks it, breaks the glass. <laughs> had a slug. He just hands her the bottle. Just, yeah. And going. Yeah. And, and then she me, hands uh, it back. I'll I'll, I'll do this test. and I'll show that I can't I can't grab yeah. grasp anything. Um, as ironic as it is to be called spirits, I cannot 12. commune with such any longer. Okay. So she's still on her feet, but she's probably thinking, I better not try that again. <laughs> or I better be sitting down. Because she will be falling down next. Oh, time. yeah. She's so tiny. Yeah. So tiny. Yeah. It's like Japanese, not but, yeah. incredibly well known for holding tons of And liquor. I mean... Ivan lasts when he gets the bottle back. This one is a drinker. I appreciate it. Bad things happen. It's five foot three, 115 pounds. Um, L will also need to make a strength test when she drinks some. Because she is a lightweight, as she's never had alcohol in her life before. Oh. oh. They've never Lock imbibed up. fermented fruit on the fourth floor. Lock weight up. Living lands. Oh, you're right. It would never. You're right. It would, it never would, it would decompose never immediately, or or it would be rush, lush and overripe. You're right. Yeah. You're right. It w wouldn't have time to ferment. No, it could not. It cannot ferment in the living yeah. lands. Didn't well, think about that. Fourteen strength. Say again. Fourteen, 14 strength. Okay. Yeah, she's gonna. I get mean, rough. she she takes it. Kind of swishes it around in her mouth. I'll let you decide whether she actually likes it or doesn't. I do you want to drink disinfectant? That's what it tastes like. She wouldn't like. know what disinfectant oh. is. That's what vodka does taste like. Yeah. <laughs> why, I, I mean, why do I okay, want to drink so something <laughs> that kills the things on the outside? Because I have things inside me that I want to kill. <laughs> I think the best analogy I've had for someone... Drinking something that they don't like was in the Vixen Warbride series. When he gives his Kitsune wife coffee. Okay. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and she takes a sip of it. And when she goes back and tells her friends about this horrendous drink and they say, what is it called? And she says, brown sadness. <laughs> But well, she probably goes like, this is vile, and takes another pull. No, yeah, she probably does, but yeah, no, the Kitsune in that one was like, dark brown sadness, or something to that effect, but I know it said brown and sadness, and they're like, oh, that sounds terrible. <laughs> that was such a great series, actually. Weirdly great. What series was that? The Vixen Warbright. Yeah, I think that's the reason why. It's fairly new. Is it on Netflix or is it on... No, to... it's books. Books. It's a uh, manga. It's not uh, even uh, manga. It's a book. Oh, sorry. That's not what I understood. That's my bad. It is It is a tome. Uh, yes, it is a tome. <clears throat> it is six books in, in total. It's not too long. It's science fiction, humans and fox people. That's why she's a vixen. And the guy was writing it kind of based on a story he heard about uh, some bartender in Japan at the end of World War II that was like, came up to the Americans and was like, hey, I did bad things because I was running this bar and soldiers were in this bar. I need to be punished. And they're like, no, you don't. Yes, I do. No, you don't. Yes, I do. Fine. And they give her this, like, slap on the wrist punishment. Because they're <clears> like, you didn't do anything wrong running a bar for the soldiers. That was the one thing they didn't expect was kindness. I know. It, it, they were expecting just full utter you, uh, you desolation. Lit okay, so my sister's mother-in-law, deceased, is Okinawan. Yeah. She... I can't remember if it was her or her mother that was on Okinawa when it, the invasion. They were four at the time. 
and the Japanese, knowing they were losing the island, handed all of the civilians a hand grenade and said, if it looks like the Americans are going to take you, pull the pin, because they'll do worse to you than what we did. Yeah. And if you know how the Japanese treated the Okinawans, you understand why the Okinawans were a little pissed at England when England said, no, 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 you can't be part of the United States, you have to go back to Japan. Because the Okinawans were like, wait, we can be with them? Yeah. And the U.S. was like, <clears throat> sure. Yeah. And the Okinawans were fully on board. We will learn English. We are excited about this. And then Britain, because the U.S. was saying, okay, give everyone their country back. Yeah. Decided, well, you can't have Okinawa. It's because they had to give back Hong Kong in 89 or something like that. Like 99. It was part of... It was a 100-year lease. Well, you're right. 100-year right. lease. You're right. It was basically Britain being yeah. pissy because the U.S. said, okay, let everyone have their country back. And so Britain said, no, you can't have Okinawa. It belongs to Japan. And it's like, not if you ask the Okinawans yeah. of the time. I should mention that of the time. Because Japan doesn't treat them like shit anymore. But anyway. Uh, <coughs> Russian party, yes. Yeah, we're, dry, we're drinking and dragging. <laughs> They're drinking. <coughs> so, uh, you going to talk and about what we're here for? Yeah, I, I mean, <laughs> does bring it up of <coughs> why are you here? Oh, we need a car. <coughs> ah. We need yes. a mode of transportation because we need to get over here. Or over there. Over there. Do you show him where? Yeah. Yeah. I, I uh, can tell him exactly where. Yeah. Yeah. Where. Okay. Yeah. That that's what I need to know. Do you actually show him? Yeah. You have that coordinate. Yeah. He's like, yeah. huh? Well, that is a long distance. Um. There's a bit of a border dispute here, and he kind of shows you on the map where it is, and it's. Not quite Russia and Ukraine. It's a bit before. Russia and Ukraine having a border dispute? Since when? <laughs> yeah, I know. And this was even written before that. So Yeah. Well, they've been fighting for... Well, yeah, they were... I, yeah, well, they, they have been antagonistic satellite. for... Since Ukraine became Ukraine. Yeah. But no, it's like... It's inside of Russia where the border dispute is and okay. Ivan is like yeah this is where two of the leaders of Tharkold are kind of fighting over this border no. one of the leaders it's not named a country border it's Volkov? a border border it, it's kind of a territorial border between Factions. One is the President Volkov of Russia. And he spits when he says that. Mm, interesting. Cool. I'll spit with him because of him. Yeah. Awesome. Cultural. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> I tried. Like, ah. Uh, uh, Maybe the, the Baba Yaga rain her fury upon that man's head for what he did to. Our country. Oh, yeah. He's the one that nuked the I was like, <laughs> Yes. He I'm glad he said her. I was like, Bobby, oh, you got Keanu Reeves in Russia now? <laughs> John Wick. I know. Yeah, all right. <laughs> I haven't seen John Wick, and no. I know the reference. See, I'm thinking of, I, I, I read I read Russian folk tales. Mm -hmm. So I, know, oh, yeah. I knew Baba Yaga growing up. And then um, Ant-Man 2, where oh. she just appears, she goes, Baba Yaga. They don't need my children. Just he's freaking out because she just shows up out of nowhere and he's like, oh my gosh, she's real. <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah when Ghost appears. Yeah. Yeah. It, it took me a minute to figure, remember where that was at. I'm it's like, not okay. a true serum. It is a true serum. It is a true serum. <laughs> it's such a. With the exception of the rest of the film, it's a good part. I liked Ant Man too. I've never seen the third one. I, I understand. I, I it has parts that are good. 
Yeah, that's what I hear. It's like, it's a meh movie with great parts. Some of the CGI was extremely lacking, which was disappointing. Like, we reverted back to, like, Scorpion King level. Oh. Like, Mummy oh. 2 level. It was like, oh. oh. oh why did you do that? And then why would you do that? Money, but yeah. Well, the funny thing is, they spent a whole bunch of money on the CGI and stuff like that. They just, I think some of the and money went somewhere someone else. someone ran off with the money. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Didn't pay anyone with it. Uh, it's the, I mean, that's one of the complaints I hear about the Acolyte. They spent all this money. Oh. Where did it go? <laughs> they spent it on people that didn't purposely did not know anything about Star Wars. And then uh, I know. they tried to fix that error. Um, no, they don't seem to be trying to fix that. I want to ask Ivan, so President Volkov, uh, who, what's the other faction that's vying for the control of the region? Of the... Oh. If it doesn't matter, uh, the you could The one say. I know of that's here is Jezreel. Jezebel? Mm. Jezreel. Jezreel, okay. She's the slave that killed the guy. Yeah, J-E-Z... R A E L. She's the chick on the book. Yeah, yeah, the yeah. one with her foot on his yeah. chest. Yeah, <laughs> that's her. <laughs> Jezreel. Okay. J E Z R A I L. A E L. Yeah. A E L. Thank yeah. you. Jezreel. Jezreel. Like her story yeah. is fascinating because, like, as like he, her, her master's like, gives a split second defense and she stabs him and he just is like, perfect and she's just like. No, because he did that because it would permanently torture her forever. Because right. that, that she did exactly it basically what, he what it was was she took the dagger that he gave her to kill someone else and killed him with and it. And he pulled her off. He took her leash off, and she just turned and stabbed him. Perfect. And the darkness device was sick of him, and cut him off from all possibilities. Mm -hmm. And as he's trying to think of what to do, he comes up with the best thing he can do to her. And that's, he says, I'm so proud of you. <sighs> and of all the things he could say to her, that was absolutely the worst. Because it basically told her, you are everything I made you to be. Some real good psychological mess. Oh, yes. And basically, that was his dying torment to her. Is like, good job, I made you what I wanted you to be. Nice. <clears throat> cool. And okay. yeah, so she is one of the ones in the running for the dark. Would it be possible to get away from that border dispute, or is that border dispute right where we need to go? Uh, well, you're going to have to cross that border dispute, unless you can swim. How wide is the river? I got hiccups. Uh, actually, it's a sea. It's called the Black Sea. Oh, what's the distance? I mean, that yeah. doesn't pose much of a threat to me, but... What's the distance? I don't Trust. legitimately do not know the size of the Black Sea. We need it's a not boat. big. We'll need a boat. I mean, um, they the have sea, blue water navy it, it, in it's it. It's moderately larger than Lake Erie, Lake Superior. Oh, okay. Yeah. yeah. Okay. I can't see across it readily. No, you no, would no, not no, be no, able to see across it. It is a sea. Yeah. Yeah, but that doesn't mean anything. Yeah, <laughs> it's not as big as the Mediterranean. And this is the one that's where they house their aircraft carrier, right? It's the one where they sank the private. It's the, the Russian dry dock, yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah. that sea. Okay. That was funny. Not for the Russians, but not I, for the Russians, but for everyone else, it yeah, was funny. At, uh, yeah, and, yeah, that's the yeah, World War Two where they went to bomb it. No, we're talking about the most recent war. Oh Jesus! Yeah, yeah. that is where the was... flagship of the Russian Navy was, and Ukraine sank it. Yeah, with a Triton t missile. It was a no, I, it was oh. a, their version of, of a harpoon, and they launched yeah. like three of them at it. No, I was, I was watching something. It's drained the oceans, and it was uh, during World War One or Two. They had a naval ship, Russian one, that uh, I think the not the Finnish bomb. Somebody, it was like, but I'm thinking of the Baltic Sea, so it doesn't matter. But yeah, yeah. well, they thought about bringing a ship there because it's in shallow enough water they could probably raise it. 
But yeah. the, for them to bring it, the ship they need to bring over is over it's 100 years old. Super expensive, yeah. yeah. And so, and half the crap on the ship didn't work before. <laughs> well, they launched it unfinished, right? Well, it was, like they were still working on it as it was sailing. Well, like the problem with the Russian fleet is when they're brand new, they're good. But when they go into refurbish, they don't. Oh. They have it's so corrupt. They say it's done, and it's not really done. Right. Yeah. So, like for the for the. For the like anti air to work, they would have to turn off their radio. <laughs> <laughs> they would have to turn something else off because they just don't have the, the power. Yeah, the everything power. is so corrupt. They talked about how great their military is, but their military has sat in its motor pool for basically since World War Two. Yeah, oh, we're, we're, which is yeah. not what happened it, to America because we haven't stopped fighting. Yeah. Well, and also it's like the the tires on their. Uh, That's what I'm saying. Yeah. It sat. Everything rotted. And the new tires that they bought, they didn't buy the new tires. They somebody stole the money. Someone for pocketed yeah. the money. And said, "Oh yeah, we're good. We're good, good. We're good." And then half the tires blew out on the mm-hmm. way there. I mean, Russia's really so. good at the whole. Uh, do you think capitalism? Yeah. Do you think it'll improve when Putin finally dies? No. 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 He has too many cronies that are just like him. It stopped when he went out of power, and then what happened, what, five, six years later, the guy who came in as the premier is like, oh, thank you for voting me in. I now create a position that is higher than the premier and permanently give it to Putin. Yeah. Like, that's why we were finally out of the trenches. But and then it was like, yeah, nope. Someone literally, it, 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 Hitler would have been proud of the coup. Yeah. Yeah, no. There there would be there would unfortunately need to be a lot of bloodshed to end the corruption in the Russian government. And yeah, all it'd do is create a power vacuum that the Russian mafia had filled. So I don't know if we'd be in a better spot. Fair. <laughs> so well, we're, it, it really is the devil you know. Bubble claws, my daughter. Julia was saying hi to everybody. Hi. 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 Um, <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, vehicle. Wow, we are not staying on track tonight. We're doing pretty but good considering doing two months. Good, but, but we're not yeah. doing as good as we should. Let me see what Alan be. can pull up and buy cars. So, I mean, <laughs> yeah, he's like, hmm. Like I said, I mean... Border dispute, mm, highway bandits, about the same thing. Nile. <sighs> Get a good enough car, you can outrun them. Or blow them off. Whichever you prefer. Uh, I'm not sh- I, I, I think we probably just want to outrun everything, I think. Mm. Yes. Outrun. Yeah. But Hold it needs on. to be big enough for the five of you. Correct. Uh, and it still needs armor. Mm. I, if you have it like a old Suburban. Yeah. Um, or uh, what, what are those? Uh, minivans. Russian. They're like Jeeps, but they're not really Jeeps. BMP? I think that's what I'm thinking of. No. No. Burdum. We call them Burdums. Hmm. BRDM. I was thinking of uh, uh, Alan using his glamour skill to just illusion, but only lasts for a minute. No, it's called a BRDM, and it's kind of an armored car. It's their version of a Humvee. Okay. If I'm remembering my vehicle recognition right, pretty sure it's a BRDM. How much fuel does it have? How much... Uh, can we go on what that is? Asking the GM. A BRDM? Yeah. I mean... Does he have one readily available? Well, oh, I'm sorry. I thought that's what you were offering. No. Fred was asking, and I'm like, I'm going through vehicle recognition, Russian vehicles. What was it? BMP, and then I thought about it and was like, no. BMP is BMP. P meaning pole because 
the sprockets in the front. That's an armored personnel carrier. That's not what it is. What was that? BRDM. Okay, yeah, that's the one. Okay. Um. Okay. Um. Percentage. What's good? High. High is Hi. good. He's like, ah, oh, no. We do not have any uh, old Russian military equipment here. Um, well, um, we do have a modified bug. Okay. Can, can it fit all of us? I mean, can I, I'm going to ask well, a silly question. We can modify it to do so. Um, yeah, I, I so can I just. You, can I sit in the car? Yes. I can sit in the chair. Will it drive, if it drives faster than you, do you stay behind? Yeah. No, I, I, I travel with a vehicle. Okay. I, I, yeah, perfectly. Yeah. I can be contained and like you can, you can put me in a cargo, I can just leave it. Yeah. So he, the, he the one thing I can't. decide what he, I would say, connects with. No. So. Um, to a degree. Unlike normal toward ghosts i can't go through walls oh really yeah that's i'm incorporeal in that i can't interact with equipment oh but i can be contained okay yeah okay that's I mean, why i couldn't go through the door when we were silly in the question can't we just put you in like a jar and it would have to be a fucking five and a half foot jar well we can't just like compress no you? i'm still me you would put the jar through me. That's so, we're gonna no, no. There's a Luigi Mansion. In this crap, man. <laughs> how would you ma how would you manipulate my body? To a vacuum. I'm how dare you, sir? <laughs> how dare you? Uh, what about a ghost trap from Ghostbusters? It would be a Ghostbuster vacuum. Yeah, I mean, I'm pretty sure. Oh, where's Zed? How dare you, sir? No, I'm uh, I'm functionally a human for most aspects, and then as a ghost, it's really just. Uh, uh, I, I don't get to cool, <clears throat> do cool ghost things. Like, I don't get the uh, glow. I don't get to... Well, so without you, there are four bodies. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's a bug. We could fit four bodies and just have the ghost in there a little bit. Oh, and also, yeah, because we're not... We're all kind of not very huge people. No, I'm well, tiny. Yeah. I also can just sit on the roof. Uh, I guess Casey could, would determine can if you that was good or bad. I mean, yeah, I, mean, I could, could, I could sit, sit in the, the trunk. trunk. Get in the engine compartment, just kind of like... <laughs> <laughs> this is heating up, guys. I mean, at the end of the day, it's really just, it's up to Casey. Yeah. They're, they're, the, they're, the rules aren't written to assume that I do ghost weird shit. It's like, yeah. I'm just a body. I, I have... I, I, I can't... I mean, what they're saying Actually, is they have a working bug... That if you give them time, they will modify it to be able to carry all of you. Okay, fantastic. Good for me. If How much time do they you need? want something else, give them some time and they might be able to find it. Oh, man. But yes, Ivan does seem more than willing and predisposed to help his friend. Would you... Not bulk is not the right word, but that's the only word I can come up with. Be against playing a second connection card. Um, at this point, yes, because and there's totally fine. Only yeah. so many connections. That's, that's totally come fine. And I'm giving you the connection. I've already given you the yeah, connection. Yeah, yeah. You've already given us what we need. I just we have options. Why I wanted to make sure. Yeah, there are options. Yeah. The immediate option is unfortunately a bug. If you would like to wait a day and use skills to perhaps find something better, you can do that. Oh, heck yeah. Let's I think help them. Yeah, I think that's reasonable. Yeah, help them. Wait a day exactly. and help them. Exactly. So they want you to spend the night no matter what. Absolutely. Done. 
And if you take the next day to do skill tests to help them scavenge and find, yeah. I will roll percentage again with a bonus and see what you find. Um, I'm going to make another strength check because Usagi's going to take a couple belts. Okay. Before my, bed. Yeah. My question is, how long does it take for the new cat to show up? Does it? So I don't know. <sighs> per the perk, yes, it does. She does know that. Though. Oh, okay, okay. At the beginning of the act. Okay. Oh, so we need a new act to happen. Yes. That's yeah. what I was curious. Yeah, it about. comes up in a new act, but like we're not near that right this moment. No. And sure. she doesn't know that. No. So. Valid. Um, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she's probably catatonic. Um, not a mishap. A one. Oh, what? Yeah. I mean. She grabs the bottle when it comes to her neck, and she throws her head back in. She After like a doesn't. second or two, she just continues back. Yep. And the bottle falls free. Oh, no. Well, let's see. Someone's going to try and grab the bottle. Yeah, Alan, Alan's going to try to grab the bottle. Okay. Me. Now, what, the guy next to her is self-aware enough that okay. he sees what's going on and is able to grab the bottle before... <sighs> It, uh, it spills more than what he real. It was spilling around her mouth, and that's kind of why he realized what yeah, was going on. I'm going to try to grab her so she doesn't hit her head. And she falls back. I mean, at this point, everyone's kind of seated. Um, she goes unconscious. Yeah. And her illusion drops. And she's just got mascara stains all over her face. Aww. Just she's been crying. Elle takes her to where they're gonna be sleeping and they go to bed. There's a there's a negative to having an illusion up all the time. Yeah. Alright. Yeah, Usagi is not in a good state of mind. And Elle will probably get um, a, like a washcloth and wash her face off and then so since the I duration mean, is, the women will take care of yeah. her. Since the duration is L. concentration, L I'm, and the women uh, here. Yeah. Um, and I don't need to sleep. I'm going to remain vigilant, and I'm going to precog awareness to increase everybody's physical defenses. Ooh, cool. Yes, I am. Uh, where, what number am I at? So standard is ten. I'm at eighteen base. Seventeen is. Plus three. Four, 22, nice. so that is outstanding. So uh, everybody's in physical defense is all increased by two as long as you're within 20 meters of me. It's a good ways. It's concentration-based, so it's forever. Until you see a cat. But, uh, until she makes another critical hit. <laughs> 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 She's the one excluded. No. Because <laughs> it says allies, and she scares the shit out of me. No. Um, that would be fair. Yeah. <laughs> no, I'm, she's included because I don't want her to accidentally pick me up. <laughs> she, like, goes to the club and accidentally hits you. He dissolves. <laughs> okay. I mean, it doesn't work like that, though. What kind of skills do we need in the morning? Yeah. Okay, so... This I will allow for, I will allow, find survival, land vehicles using mind instead of dex hmm. to work on something. And those, I, if you can convince me of another skill, I'll accept okay. it. Uh, Usagi is very happy with being taken care of. Uh, she kind of goes off away, and you hear this very loud shout <laughs> of her powers activating. And she doesn't come back looking like Sailor Moon. She comes back looking like Sailor Moon in Russian gear. So she's got <laughs> she's got the the uh, ushanka and like the, the the fur coat and stuff like that. <laughs> I was like, how do you say sailor in Russian? I don't know. I don't know. I only know Spanish. You said survival, land vehicles with mind, and find. 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 Okay. 
and anything you can convince me of. I'm. That's can not I, too far fetched. Can I convince if you? If you said well, medicine. Can no. I convince you with a persuasion? I, I was gonna say I have drama and hero How in my hand. How are you using the persuasion? Ah, uh, <laughs> that is the thing. You're trying to. You have to convince hey, me, boys, help me that out. it's Wiles. going to work. Wiles. She wants to. She wants to ask around to see if like anybody's like hiding any special parts that maybe could be used better because she's a okay she's, that's fair there's that's definitely fair. boys would like oh yeah oh th- that sprocket's perfect i'm gonna hide it so nobody could screw with it yeah and yeah. I'm like, um she'll be willing to fair. dress up as if they have a picture of like someone they like to so see she'll dress up as them can i use i want to use both my hero and my drama i'm, I'm preempting it i'm going to use them both because there are two possibilities precog and if I roll high enough, I want to give everybody potentially plus two or plus four to the rolls as I'm telling everybody what would make. It's like uh, to the, the luck potion in Harry Potter. Yeah. That's kind yeah. of what I want to attempt. That, I'm fine with that. I love yes. that. All right. Absolutely. So first roll is an 11. So that's a zero. I'm happy with that. Drama. So I'll keep that. I might as well roll both. All right. So 18. And it, so does it does it so it says as a possibility so it's is it it's ten or low still counts as ten yeah. okay so eighteen and five so the five will be a ten so twenty eight plus eleven I also play a drama card thirty nine correct and then my precog is sixteen so fifty five oh fifty what yeah because uh, no. That's just thirty nine plus my pre eleven. No, 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 no. no, no. I have dice on the total. I, I haven't gotten there yet. Oh, you're right. You're right. I'm an idiot. Wait. Yeah, because yeah, you're right. So I'm at thirty nine. Thirty nine. Thirty nine dice roll. Right. Okay. Yeah. So I'm not even close to sixty. I don't want to spend no. that uh, extra possibility. Um. So yeah. Sorry. So thirty nine. Eleven plus sixteen. Twenty seven. Twenty seven. I will give a plus four for that because that Beautiful. is very good. And I'm playing good. That play is drama, and I played the hero. Oh. Wah, wah, wah. Without the bonuses, I have a 23 persuasion. Okay. So. <clears throat> and 23 is still going to be outstanding. Yeah, you talk around and use your feminine charms on a couple of the guys. Yeah. And Romance card. No. <laughs> Sorry. Again. It's like you talk to one and you're like, okay, yeah. I've got this turbocharger. I was kinda hoping to put on something and you get another one and you're like, okay. Yeah, I've got this truck body and chassis it doesn't have an engine but it's a very solid it's solid bones yeah it would make a great truck if we had the rest of the parts yeah it just need it needs that's awesome it needs an engine it needs a transmission <coughs> but it, it's a good solid like Uh, I don't know the Russian equivalent, but basically like a good 1970s truck. Toyota, yeah. Half-ton truck. Okay. So is the precog my check, or can I also make a fine check? Um, You can also make a fine okay. check. What was your total bonuses with all the precog-y stuff? What, did, what does precog give you? Give us. Plus four. Plus four? would have given yeah. you a plus four. Alan has an 11 find. He's flying, trying to see if he can find anything weird in the fields and stuff like that. Okay. Spend a possibility. My last one. Yeah, no. Alan doesn't really see anything. Okay. So 19. I'm surprised you didn't have him use his land vehicles of mine. He doesn't have land vehicles. Yeah, Alan's not a driver. Fred, oh, Fred Fred's always, always been the driver. Is My bad. Yeah. Zed was the driver. Zed was the um, driver. Wade can drive. He's just not as good as Zed. 16. So that's a 20 find. A 20 find. Okay. Yeah. And 
I mean, you're the last one, but Usagi's kind of come and said, hey, these are the things we already have. Yeah. So this is kind of the stuff we're trying to find. And so you you you're looking around and yeah you you find it's basically just an engine sitting on a frame and you're like hey wait a minute we're looking that could, for an engine that could work yeah I mean I don't know and so you kind of point that out and everyone and it's it's a little bit buried in the junk yeah. So, yeah, it's kind of been overlooked a bit. But with that body and frame, engine's a good thing. Nice. Uh, what was yours, Fred? Well, uh, Elf got a 24, 26 find. Okay. And I got like a 12, 16 for the plus four. Okay. Beautiful. So it's actually thanks to L, but Wade kind of has to be there because he knows what they're, you're looking for. Mm-hmm. But yeah, you do find it looks like a transmission that just kind of got lost out in the middle of a field. Don't know how. It's near the junkyard, so mm. it probably just came out of a car that was being brought here. Got bumped wrong, wasn't really set in. Nice. So we can localize all that and figure out how long it'll take to do it up. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, they look and they're like, oh. Okay, yeah, we, that, that's, we can make this work. That's kind of what they're like. We're like, okay, we can make this work. It's probably be a good We've got the part. To stop. I have to be in the work in the morning. Okay. Okay. Mm-hmm. So, yeah. They will assemble that, and yeah, it is a good place to stop. So, we do have blurb. It's not on there. It isn't? No. Oh, then I guess I didn't finish it. Anyway, thanks for tuning in tonight. Uh, go ahead and head on through the fellow shop and buy some swag on your way out, and we will see you later.